All right. Alright guys, I'm getting your names here for Heritage. I'll be right back. Let me grab those cases. Okay. What's up, Ryan? You really think so? I know you're. Not, I know you're not a Cody Mark. I uh, get that out of the way. Ooh, he has posted it. I got you got you guys uh, sent off the email you guys for this uh, heritage. I just got to figure out the combo teams I'm going to use here. So last year we did 28 spots, but I think what we did was one com one triple combo team. I don't know if, how it's going to work out this time around. First of all, I'm looking to see if there's any teams that lack autographs entirely.
Looks like the Marlins are one of those teams. The Mets have one auto. I'll kind of put them on the back burner here. Nationals are definitely going to be comboed with somebody. Maybe I'll mark here. Well, everybody was saying that that spot was meant for Stone Cold, but uh, they couldn't get Stone Cold uh, to agree to show up. So that's why it was Undertaker. The only thing that I, the only thing I didn't like about the uh, I, I I love that they had the different cameos and stuff, which is all well and good. But I kind of wish Undertaker was there in full garb as opposed to just uh, the skull cap and a in a hoodie. <laughs> Rockies are another team without an auto. Oh, Cena? I think he was more worried about not tripping because, you know, it's that's a it doesn't look like it, but it's a fairly that that, that decline on that on that entrance ramp is um, it's a little bit uh, more pronounced than you may think. But, you know, Cena is every bit of his 48 years of age or whatever it is, so. I think he's three years younger than The Rock. Okay. Alright, so I got three teams with zero autographs. I got uh, two teams with just one autograph. Um, I think I'm probably going to combo up the Padres with somebody. Let me look at the rookie content on the... I just want to make sure I get these teams right. It's not going to be exact science here. Maybe what I should do is just do one triple combo team like I did last year. Consisting of the three non-autographed teams. And this will look rookie content here for Rockies and... Rockies do have a couple of relics couple of short prints a couple different rookies what about the nationals the other thing that's goofy with tops heritage this year is the first hundred cards are a short print this year as opposed to the last hundred it's a little different change of pace there nationals have a few rookies What about the Marlins? I think I'm going to take the three teams that lack autographs, just put them up as one combo team. So it'll still be 28 spots, but it's going to be 27 individual teams and one triple combo. All right, so... So that's going to be uh, that's going to be how we'll run it. <clears throat> if there were only two teams that were lacking an autograph, and then I had two teams that had one autograph, I would have done some kind of a combo with those. But uh, just like last year, I think last year I had three teams that were lacking an autograph, and it just there wasn't any excuse me any combination that made total sense.
The Undertaker has wrestled. It feels like he's wrestled every single major ne- major member of the Bloodline at some point or another. Uh, somebody pointed out Yokozuna, um, Roman, of course, Rock. Um, who else? Oh, Rikishi. I mean, like it. it, it he, somebody's like, it, there was a reason for the Undertaker over there. He's pretty much fought this family his whole life. <laughs> I'm like, well, touche, fair point. All right, uh, just do one more quick check here before we begin. I'm sure his heritage is going to take us a little time. Yeah, not too much releasing this week. We got heritage today. We got uh, Topsy UEFA Soccer on Friday. I'm still waiting for a checklist on Topsy UEFA Soccer. I can't post any pre-sales unless I know how many teams are in that product. And I've yet to see a checklist at this point, so... If they do put out a checklist some point today, I can always post some pre-sales uh, for um, for Friday. Yep, still no checklist, best I can tell on that soccer. Uh, I have not. I have not saw the pre-sale in Bowman yet. I barely pay attention to pre-sale stuff these days because to me everything is just kind of like hearsay until I actually see the product. <laughs> oh. I just find it kind of weird that I got four cases of Topps UEFA soccer and they still, you know, and they still can't release a checklist. Like, you know, as soon as they release a checklist, I can post post that stuff. I mean, if, if, whether it's a pre-sale or whether it's live is irrelevant. You know, I just want to make sure I want to have it available for you guys, but right now I can't. Two fifty nine for a hobby box. I think if somebody was telling me something. It might have been Chad was telling me like uh, he was telling me like round numbers like two fifty for hobby and five hundred for jumbo. Hi, Greg. Shot done. Let's go. Say one, two, three, go. Okay. All right. Let's get rolling. All right, guys. Our first Ram Team's case break here at 2024 Heritage Baseball is into his house. Thank you for joining in. And thank you guys again for your support of Firehand Cards. We appreciate you guys very, very much. Uh, this year's Topps Heritage is in the style of 1975 Topps Baseball, which is a uh, favorite amongst a lot of um, a lot of folks. Uh, aside from the two Ram Teams cases we got going today, uh, we're also going to be doing a, uh, a Pick Your Player um, case break that is um, via auction. Um, and uh, if you go to firehandcards.net, and I just put a link in the chat, you'll see all of our player auctions. For a full case break of that, those uh, auctions end on Friday, and Andy will have that break for you guys on Friday night on the uh, the district.net platform. All right, uh, this is a 28 spot break. Um, after going through the teams and to try to determine combos, uh, there are three teams in the product that lack autographs, so we comboed up those three teams as one combo spot. So there's 27 solo spots and one triple combo. Uh, we think, if I remember right, we had to do something similar last year. Uh, it was either last year with the regular series or the high number. I can't remember for sure. But either way, same thing as uh, before in that respect. All right. 
Uh, let's roll dice. Anyway, times I randomize the list of participants and teams, all cards will ship for your team. Good luck. All right, it's going to be just two clicks in the randomizer. Red ink would be red ink or multiple ink would be good. For sure. There it is. That's better. All right, box coming right at the bottom. Up top is Carl Moore. All right, two clicks. Let's get it. Once. Twice. All right, Webb Jr. at the top. Gear on bottom. Uh, the other thing that's kind of interesting and different this year is that um, uh, it's the first 100 cards that are short printed this year. Last uh, Previous years has always been the last 100. Excuse me. All right. Uh, Angels top and Yankees bottom in the one, uh, one triple combo team, Marlins, Nationals, and Rockies. All right, two clicks. Once, twice. Royals be at top, Cubs be at the bottom. I wish Cena would just buzz his head off or do something about that bald spot. That bald spot bothers me. <laughs> I'm not one to talk about being bald, but it just... I wish he'd do something about it for himself, you know. Uh, box break, Red Sox, Brantley Lee Orioles, uh, Bruvy, Marlins, Nationals, and Rockies, CB Mac G Athletics, Seacurts Pirates, Dennis Cardinals, Foxcom Marine, Phillies, and Rays, Gator Lum with the Cubs, Gears, Mariners, White Sox, and Tigers, uh, Jay Johnson, Astros, Jonathan Mansuto, Brewers, Yankees, and Padres, uh, Carl Moore, Angels, Kim Young Sook, Braves, uh, Neo Reds, Okuri Banto Giants, uh, Paul Canton, Mets and Blue Jays, uh, Five Side 40 Guardians, Twins and Dodgers, Ram, Diamondbacks, Greg, Rangers, and Webb Jr. Royals. Well, when he's got the hat on, he, it, it like, the little bald spot is like a reverse, it's like a reverse, uh, a reverse Yarmouk. You know those, uh, you know the, the little hats that you have to wear when you're, go, when you're going into, uh, you're going into Temple? It's like the reverse of that. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, he keeps pushing his hair back. I, I could tell he's conscious about it. But I'm kind of surprised all the Hollywood magic and all that money he's made that uh, they haven't found a solution for him yet. I'm sure they're working on something. But I will tell you this, like on Sunday when Rock and Cena were facing each other, is it either Rock got so much bigger over the last couple of years or Cena actually dropped some weight. I'm not really sure which, which it's like one of those optical illusions. I'm not sure which one it is. I'll alert the media, Ryan. <laughs> I'm sure we all do. <laughs> uh, you know what, guys? I will be right back because I feel like... Oh, no. Never mind. I Try to think. I thought I had a like. I thought I had some more thirty-five point top loaders around here, and the hundreds will suffice for the relics. Okay. All right. Let's rock. Uh, this first break will probably take a little bit longer, and subsequent breaks. Ah, pretty cool. I got box loaders here, Evan Carter. Uh, I promise you guys, since this is actually product I'm opening, I won't be signing these and sending them to you as April Fool's jokes like we did with some of the... You know, all those uh, all those box letters that I, I, I signed a bunch of uh, box letters from the Heritage High Number, and the only reason I did that, those were coming from boxes that were opening up, giving away packs. And as an April Fool's joke, we sent those to some of our bigger, bigger customers. I had guys going like, whose signature is this? I'm like, yeah, it's mine. <laughs> Uh, also, um, I've already been told reliably that there's going to be one box in each case that will have the um, all the, um, uh, the purple refractors. There will be a purple refractor hot box in here. And I think this one's going to be it because I see a purple refractor. Uh, let's see. I'm just trying to see how they um, 
pack these out. All right, so the first one is George Springer, as far as the purple refractor goes. And it looks like uh, the other thing that's kind of goofy is that I don't know if they use different color gray stock or whatever to try to match the uh, old seventy five. I don't think there's don't think that has to do with any uh, kind of short print deal or anything like that. And then they also replicated these as well. Except what they did is instead of doing the first twenty uh, the first twenty five years, I think they did the next twenty five years. Uh, we'll split the, uh, just to let you guys know, these aren't short printed, and so we'll split these up 50-50 between the two teams that are featured on each card for you guys. There's Devin Carter, Ricky. Um, oh, I guess, okay, so, and just to let you guys know, the first 100 cards are the short prints in this stuff this year, as opposed to the last 100 cards. Everything's shipping out for your team, so I'm just going to go ahead and stack them. Jordan Lawler, rookie. Hank Davis, rookie. Um, I doubt that they're going to triple print him like they did in regular tops. I wonder if Lawler's another one of those guys I should be uh, highlighting. I'm just looking to see. I think I'm probably going to start sleeping him. I don't, I don't think Lawler was in Series 1 on uh, tops. Yeah, I'll go ahead and take care of him, too. <laughs> nice. <laughs> We're going to have a good day today. Oh, we got here a uh, Chrome Refractor, Austin Riley for the Braves. I like how they did these this year. Uh, Braves going to Kim Young Sook. Uh, Jordan Westberg is the next uh, Purple Chrome. There's Dominguez. Uh, high number of Gary Sanchez, card 11. Uh, this is a white border. I guess white borders are new this year. Uh, Spencer uh, Horowitz. I'm not sure how often the white borders are supposed to come. But uh, they're there. There's Nevin Carter Purple. Uh, purple Refractor for the Rangers. Greg. I hope it will, too. It, it, moved, it started moving pretty quickly. so Yeah, I got eight boxes of that stuff left. So we'll do a couple of four-box breaks of that stuff and close out what we have. Uh, we had some, uh, somebody came to chat and asked to buy some, uh, choice boxes outright, so I only got a couple of those left. I could always maybe run, like, a three-box break of that down the line if I still have them. Jordan Adams, uh, George Kirby there. Uh, Jordan Hicks, high number. Uh, Bo Bichette, purple. Jordan Westberg. Uh, Corey Seager. Corbin Carroll. Uh, Jaron Duran, uh, low number. I guess low number, I guess, is what I have to call it now. <laughs> uh, Bryce Harper, purple. Jazz Chisholm, purple. Uh, PCA, we're going to sleeve him. We didn't have PCA in the first series aside from the occasional silver pack insert. Mikey Moustakis, big gunner.
That was still pretty cool. Uh, Rowdy, tell us um, low number. That's gonna be weird for me to say. Low number, low number, short print. There's your first uh, hit. Uh, Clubhouse Collection, Jonathan India for the Reds. Uh, Reds for Neo. Actually, you know what? I'm just going to leave these for the guys that sleeve. I'll worry about the autographs when they hit. Uh, Brian Wu. Uh, so they're in the process of uh, expanding the place out. Jordan Adams, purple. Strap in, guys. This break may take a while. <laughs> Uh, let's see, Aaron Saval, high number for the Rays. Yeah, I, I, I gotta be honest, I'm, I'm really a big fan of the uh, 75 design, so I, I honestly think this is the year to do Heritage, my opinion. Uh, white border, Gabriel Moreno. Then and now, uh, Francisco Lindor. Luciano. Uh, Tyler Stevenson, uh, low number. Trey Turner. Pete Alonzo, purple. Gordon Carroll, New Age Performers. Riley Green, purple. Kodai Singa is a uh, low number, short print. There's Caminero. That was one of the rookies I was looking for there. And Max Scherzer. Okay, that's the first box. And the box that has all the purple chromes. Um, so there are six different uh, top rookies I sleeved. I'm guessing these are probably going to be the top six. If you think I'm missing anybody off the top of your head, let me know. But... I'm trying to think. There's one. Oh, we obviously De La Cruz. If I see him, I haven't seen him yet though. So it'd probably be seven guys. All right, box dose. Yeah, I just uh, that day I like I literally got up and did nothing. Uh, it was one of those uh, Joe Torre from the Mets. Uh, box loader. It was one of those days where I felt like I needed just like a me day. <laughs> I just like pissed off just like everything I was supposed to do that day. I'm like, ah, I'm not going anywhere. So that wasn't a knock on you. Uh, no, not especially. Uh, the first box had the, all the purple chromes in it. First memorabilia hit was Jonathan India. No auto yet. Like, the only thing you miss is me saying this break's going to take a while, which is accurate. <laughs> Pretty cool he threw a couple uh, nice, nice Dusty Baker there. I don't know why that one was turned around. It's not a high number or anything. What other kind of uh, variations am I supposed to be looking for here? Is there anything else like uh, the ordinary I need to be looking for? Now inquiring minds want to know. Uh, give me a sec, guys. I just want to make sure if, like, I don't... Because, uh, like, a, a lot of other years, like, they had, like, things where, like, you know, it was, like, position variations, photo variations, all sorts of other goofy stuff, you know? So I'm just trying to... All right, so I know they got black and white image variations. Okay, that's fine. Uh, we saw the white borders. Um, 
I know this does. Um, okay, so they do a lot of black and whites. So that's fine. Um, I know all the short prints are the first hundred cards. I get that. I know there's chromes, obviously. I'm just going through the list that Topps provided here. Uh, they have a blue sparkle chrome variation. Okay. Um, yeah, white bordered. I know about those. Okay. More white borders. Uh, veteran short prints, white border. Okay, so that's just okay. Air short prints. Uh, Air short prints, color swap variations. All right. Missing facsimile signature variation. I'm just looking at the Taveras because the Taveras was flipped over. And, man, these code numbers are going to be really hard to tell. I know that the code number is different. I can tell that much. I just don't know what variation this is. But I'm not seeing anything here that would suggest that it is a variation. Nor do I actually see the loaded two various on the checklist. Wait, hold on a sec. What's this one? Uh, veteran short prints. Oh, that's white border variation. Never mind. Yeah, that's just really weird. I can I, I can tell looking at the number on the back that it is different than the others. I just don't know why. Ooh, some of these are really tough to read. I don't know, I just see a card that's flipped over, I'm supposed to look for something. I just don't know what I'm looking for. Flip stock? No, not a flip stock. It's turn around. I'll keep it aside in case I see another Tavares I can check it out. I'm sorry guys. This, this is the biggest reason why these breaks take so long, especially the first couple of breaks that we run of this, just because I don't know everything I'm looking for. So I know to carry Carpenter, it's turned around because it's a low number. Oh no, anybody that's got stock in TKO Holdings, which also, by the right way, Ryan, may be part of your 401k. I'm sure you'd be pretty happy if you thought of it in those terms. Alright, that's a low number. Stanton's 400 home run. How is Tavares and SP? Uh, the first hundred cards are short printed, aren't they? Or are they actually? Oh, is four hundred seven actually a short print? Hold on a second. You might be right. Okay, I know the first hundred cards were short prints, but um, yeah, it is a short print. You're right. Card four hundred seven. Okay, so it's not any kind of color flip or anything. That's just kind of weird. The first hundred cards are short prints plus card four hundred seven. I don't know what significance of four hundred seven is, but so be it. All right, so it's not like any other kind of goofy thing I need to be looking out for. Oh, and 82 is not a short print. Okay. Ah. Ah, it, the plot starts to unravel. Thank you, Michael. Appreciate the help. Yeah, that's what I thought. When a short print, uh, at, least, at least anything that's turned around, we know to look at something, right? There's the first Otani in a Dodger uniform that's not short printed. Pretty nice looking hit there. They just, you know, um, whatchamacallit, uh, Photoshop that one in. Uh, Tommy Henry is a low number. Looks 
Excuse me. There's a lot of number of Carson Kelly. There's Evan Carter. Still haven't seen a De La Cruz rookie yet. I'm sure it'll be, we'll have a few of those before uh, the break's done. The only thing I, the other thing I've kind of noticed is that, man, is these like, are these in like the old OPG uh, uh, slicers here? The bottom edges seem to be a tiny bit rough. Soto and Yankees jersey too, Rutherford. Oh yeah, I know. I, I know. Like it, it, if I'm just opening, just trying to find all the short prints, I know I can do it that way. Like I know I have a short print of Bellotti here, but I got other rookies and stuff. I got a sleeve here too. So there's Dominguez. Uh, white border Ryder Ryan Mariners. All right, got a Chrome to nine ninety nine self relic Brewers. Going to Jonathan Mansuto. Tom, uh, look at that. Tom Cosgrove, low number. You know, it's funny. They always work it out this way. Most of the most of the short prints and within the base sets on Heritage are like common guys. They don't put like they don't they don't take the top rookies and make them short prints, for example. Uh, Brandon Nemo Clubhouse Collection jersey for the Mets. Paul Canton. So two boxes, two memorabilia hits so far. Uh, Josiah, Josiah Gray, low number, Nationals. And uh, Harold Ramirez, white border, Rays. Image variations, black and white, will be the three or four card from the back. Okay. Uh, we got a uh, stamp buyback, Bob Reynolds, Orioles. Uh, low number of Kyle Finnegan. Evan Carter, rookie. Uh, 
Uh, Isaac Paredes for the Rays, uh, low number. Brendan Rogers, low number. Andrew Abbott, white border for the Reds. So it looks like the white borders are coming to a box. Yes, I did watch, uh, I watched the last 30 minutes, probably about the last 30 minutes of each of the two games on the multicast. Man, it was uh, some pretty exciting stuff yesterday. Hopefully today uh, provides uh, provides uh, the same, you know. Francisco Mejia for the Rays, uh, low number. 3-3 three, three in Madrid and Arsenal and Byron went 2-2. Two, two. There was another Domingo's rookie. Still haven't seen De La Cruz yet. Even money on PSG today. Uh, Felix Bautista, uh, low number. There's a Camonero Ricky. Hey, our first auto for the Diamondbacks, Slade Chaconi. Uh, Diamondbacks belong to Ram. Uh, Kyle Higa Shioka for the Padres, low number. Uh, Kodai Senga, white border for the Mets. Uh, I got a chrome here, Zach Law for the Athletics, number to 999, CB Mac G. Oh, Jordan Lawler, rookie. Uh, Lane Thomas, low number nationals. And um, got a, a low number highlights card there. Okay. <coughs> uh, I got another buyback stamp buyback here. Bill Melton, White Sox.
Uh, Brian Rocchio, uh, low number. I think it's 24. There's another Dominguez. All these Dominguez's and no De La Cruz. Got a bunch of A boxes so far, no B boxes. The Amazingly Randy low number. There's a black and white. Today we're fellow for the Red Sox. Black and white variation. The Red Sox for box break. That one's pretty easy to tell. Oh, it also has a little thing right next to the number, so that also helps. All right. Yeah, usually, um, most of the time when I've opened up Heritage, it's us I've usually found three autos a case, sometimes four, but not often more than four. But I've had cases where there's only been two on autos, historically speaking. Uh, Kay Krimble, uh, Craig Kimbrell, highlights a little number. There's another auto for the Yankees, Everson Pereira for Jonathan Mansuto. Very nice. We'll never complain about getting on card rookie autos, especially out of Heritage. So, first four boxes, two autos, two relics. <clears throat> Big pardon. I just wish they put the bubble gum in here. <laughs> Uh, Luis Garcia, uh, low number. There's never Carter Rookie. Uh, there's a white border. Uh, that's the uh, Diamondbacks. I'm not sure who's that, who that is. Uh, Sal Frank, maybe? No, who is it? Oh, uh, Merrill Kelly is a uh, player featured on the front. It would, but uh, yeah, when they first started doing Heritage Baseball, they did pack gum in the packs, but the gum was actually wrapped in its own cellophane, so it didn't create uh, create any gum stains. It was a nice throwback. And yes, after a couple of minutes, your jaw would start to hurt. That's your typical bazooka bubble gum. <laughs> uh, Jordan Hicks, low number, Blue Jays. Still have not seen a De La Cruz yet. Really weird. Yeah, boxer number four. Although I'm starting to see some names I hadn't seen previously, so maybe we finally got a B box here. Uh, Jaron Duran, low number, Red Sox. Uh, Dean Kramer, low number. There's Henry Davis. There's Ellie, finally. I knew we'd see one sooner or later. Uh, watch the uh, watch some of the Brewers Reds tilt and saw Ellie De La Cruz miss an easily easy throw on a double play ball yesterday that led to two unearned runs. Nice going there, Ellie.
First ever, the first ever summer blockbuster movie, Jaws, is released. Well, they probably had blockbusters before they just didn't advertise them as such. Speaking of Jaws. Uh, Gary Sanchez, law number, Padres. Uh, there's a PCA rookie. And a white border. Uh, Guardians and Pirates on this one. Lean Fireman. Um, we'll, we'll do a draw at the end of the break on left or right on those. Assuming we get any more. Well, you have to do a draw regardless, but you know what I mean. All right, four down. Wait, what? White borders are printed with white border on the back? Yeah, it says white border. Uh, black borders are printed with white border on the back. So if I have a black border, it's also going to say white border? <laughs> Tell me how that makes sense. Hey, there's an oversized Ellie. <coughs> yup. Yeah. <laughs> okay. <laughs> I haven't seen any black borders though. Let's see, we've done four boxes so far, so I should have eight white borders. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Yeah, I got all eight of them so far. They've been coming to a box. And the white borders, I'm guessing, are the same checklist as the chromes. They usually take like 100 cards, and those are going to be all your chromes, your minis, if they did do minis this year. And if there was ever a year to do minis in Top Heritage, it would be this year, right? Because they actually did 75 minis. Just saying. Uh, Pablo Lopez, low number, Twins. Any card, that, any card that's the 8th card down, it's a base card. I'm just going to check the back and make sure it's not some kind of a goofy variation. Uh, there's another Evan Carter. Uh, low number, Ronald Acuna. Card number one set, by the way. 70 of steel. number for the Rockies. Alright, I got a memorabilia hit here. Reed Detmers. Angels to Carl Moore. <clears throat> 40 minutes in this break. I haven't even finished the fifth box yet. <laughs> Sony launches the Betamax in Japan. Look at that machine. Uh, Jonathan India, low number. I uh, got a, a chrome refractor here, George Springer for the Blue Jays. Uh, for Paul Canton. Number to 575. And uh, there's a white border of Nolan Chanel for the Angels. Henry Davis rookie. Ellie. 
Gabrielle Arias for the Guardians, low number. PCA. Jeez, it feels like I can't even put a card in a penny sleeve right now. Uh, Jameson Talon, low number Cubs. Errors de la Cruz. Cole Calhoun, low number. That's uh, so. This is also marked as a white border, huh? To Carlos Santana. Yeah, it says white border. Right? That's pretty funny. So the black borders are also white borders. <laughs> if it's a white border, it's a white border. If it's a black border, it's still a white border. PEDs. Uh, Martin Maldonado, low number, Astros. And a white border, Oswaldo Cabrera. Are the black borders marked specifically in the checklist? They just all consider it white borders, huh? Okay. Oh, so basically any single color border is what you're saying. Another um, buyback here. Ron Schuler, Phillies. Tyler Stevenson, low number. Oh, there's the Yoshida Chrome to 999. The uh, Red Sox for the box, uh, blah, for box break. Kodai Senga, low number. <laughs> right? <laughs> Gold jacket, green jacket. Solid color, right? Uh, David Bednar, uh, low number, Pirates. Uh, there's Junior Cabanero, rookie for the Rays.
Uh, Freddy Peralta, the number of Brewers. Dominguez. Uh, Mitch Garver, low number, Rangers. Uh, let's see, Connor Joe, uh, low number. Dean Kramer, white border. Uh, Rowdy Tellas, uh, low number. Jordan Lawler, rookie. Uh, Justin Turner, Red Sox. Clubhouse collection jersey. Red Sox for box break. Uh, Aaron Saval, low number, Reyes. And Austin Meadows, white border Tigers. All right, we're halfway home, guys. Mercifully, after 49 minutes. <laughs> yep, this will be a 100-minute break. Uh, Yogi Berra Jumbo for the Mets. All right. Haven't had a chance to see what else has moved here. Uh, just to let you guys know, we still have a few spots left in the Leaf Valiant random, uh, random players case. Um, right now, the only other break I have sold out after this one, of course, is the next uh, Topps Heritage case. Uh, if something small fills out, um, I'll run it in front of the series, uh, the second um, case of this stuff, just to give a little buffer, give you guys a little bit of a break. But um, if not, obviously, we'll do our second case as uh, scheduled. <clears throat> this is one of those things I wouldn't mind having something else uh, uh, break that uh, sandwiches the two Heritage cases. But either way. Francisco Mejia, low number. Excuse me. Yeah, if I get an eighth card in the pack that looks like a base card, I'm just going to turn around just to make sure there's anything marked on it, like a, it's a photo variation or some other kind of variation I'm not recognizing. Uh, Slade Chaconian, 999 for Diamondbacks. That's a Chrome. Uh, Diamondbacks for a Ram. Uh, Isaac Paredes, low number race. There's a black and white, Martin Malnado for the Astros. Second black and white we've seen. 
Astros, Jay Johnson. Kyle Finnegan, low number nationals. Dominguez. Uh, Dalton Varsho for Blue Jays. Got a clubhouse collection relic. Blue Jays, Paul Canton. Brennan Rogers, uh, low number Rockies. Luis Camposano, white border, Padres. Stuart Fairchild, low number reds. Yeah, but it'll have a little something right here on the card number, or right next to the card number that says black and white variation or something like that. Like the Mark Melonado says uh, B&W right above the number. Very small, but nonetheless. That's why the eighth card down, if it's a regular card, I turn it over just to make sure it doesn't have anything like that on it. Bailey uh, Falter, uh, low number. Austin Riley, white border. Really interesting. Well, I know the chrome, the chromes that I've pulled have been the seventh card down each time. Uh, Chris Stratton, low number. Brand Drury, low number. Carter Rookie. Next uh, box leader is Jordan Lawler. Hmm, interesting. PCA. Uh, Mackenzie Gore, well number.
Uh, Kevin Newman low number. Henry Davis. <clears throat> uh, John Carl Stanton, low number. <clears throat> uh, Jaron Duran, uh, relic for the Red Sox, box break. Uh, Shintaro Fujinami, low number. Uh, Harrison Bader, white border. Uh, Lane Thomas, low number. Uh, Lorenzen, low number. Uh, Felix Bautista, low number. Uh, white border, black border, Days Bell, Hernandez, Braves. Uh, Kyle uh, Higashioka, low number. Uh, white border, David Hamilton, Red Sox. Okay, Box Niner. Uh, Jim Barr, uh, buyback for the Gigantes. J.P. Crawford, low number. <clears throat> uh, 
Zach Gallon low number. Emma Carter. Jake Cave low number. That is an image variation, Ronald Acuna, eighth card down, what do you know. Uh, the Braves for Kim Young Suk. Dominguez. Lawler rookie. Edward Jillian low number. Harrison Bader, low number. Uh, Chrome Refractor to 575, Shane McClanahan, Rays. Uh, Tampa Bay Rays for Fox Comarine. It's kind of weird to have a pack that um, had the Chrome card 8 down instead of 7 down. Ah, there we go. Got a color variation here in Lindor. Good thing I checked that one. Somehow, it just stuck to me as a color variation. Mets, Paul Cantor. <coughs> like I said, I hope I haven't missed any other ones. <coughs> I don't know how tough the color ones are. <coughs> I don't know the odds on any of this stuff, so... Uh, Juan Yepes, low number, Cardinals. Oh, there's a Caminero. Almost just blew right by it. Uh, Cabrian Hayes, white border. Uh, Kyle Freeland, uh, low number. One and two thirty-seven, so approximately one a case. Okay. Sometimes you might get two if you get lucky. Uh, Aaron Nola, clubhouse collection for the Phillies. Fox Marine. Shamanea, uh, low number. Oops. And a white border, Cade Marlowe, Mariners. Okay. Yeah, I think Michael's probably on this. When I do the second case, maybe I'll, what I'll do is I'll just I'll open up all the packs and just look at the card numbers on the back first uh, to rip out any uh, variations and then look through the rest of the box and. Just leave any of my rookies and find a hit. Might make the break a little faster. May not be as uh, entertaining and sexy, but uh, Michael might be right there. 
The missing, uh, the missing fast Emily. Okay. Uh, Jeff Zahn, Dodgers. I uh, just let you guys know we're down. Um, wow, so we're down a spot on uh, Ram Ram Teams case of Sterling, and the PYT case of Sterling is down to eight teams. Uh, we also moved a spot in Revolution Basketball. Still have spots available in Leaf Valiant. Still have spots available in the uh, Prison Premier League Soccer Breakaway Four Box Break, which hopefully we'll find a couple of autos there. Uh, we also have another uh, NFL Value Mixer today for you guys. Uh, another five star cases available today. Beg your pardon. Uh, random teams breaks Revolution Basketball include one spot for the next uh, Immaculate Basketball case. So in addition to the um, to the Prison ba uh, prison Basketball Blaster Box was running for you guys, they'll award out two spots in Immaculate. You can also win your way into Immaculate through Revolution. I might have missed at least one more image variation. I pulled one with the uh, what's his face with the Acuna, but uh, very possible I missed another one. Uh, Henry Davis. Yeah, but I think Michael's right. I think what I'm going to do next case is I'm going to open up all the packs and just flip through, uh, flip through them and look at the card number on the back to see because it, it'll be identified right there. I don't need to actually see the name of the variation. I just need to see that there's something there to be good enough. Uh, Alex Cobb, low, uh, low number. Okay. Yeah, there's Ellie. Austin Hayes, low number. PCA rookie. <clears throat> yeah, if I was more of a baseball guy, this would be the one-year heritage I would like to put together. Aside from, like, the 52, the first year I did heritage. But the 75 is just such an iconic design. really is. I uh, got a little number here of uh, Otani. That's a good auto to get. All right, now we're talking. Congrats, uh, Gary Lum. Got you a PCA auto. Nice. It's a nice. Uh, <clears throat> Yeah, don't discount, uh, obviously autographed hits are always great to get, regardless of which product that you're opening. But uh, in Heritage, some of the rookie autographs uh, go, some, go for some pretty good money. There's a lot of people out there that are that try to put together full master sets of Heritage. And uh, so that jumps the value of even the most common autographs some, but then when you got the top guys, top rookies, they definitely add up. Uh, this is a silver um, silver refractor 375 of PCA Cubs for Gator Lum. Uh Jordan Walker low number. Uh, 
Uh, Lane Ramsey, uh, white border for the White Sox. No doubt, right? Uh, Luis Camposano, low number. Dominic Smith, little number. Low number for the Rays. Chrysler launches the first automobile rebate that revolutionized the auto buying market forever. Okay. Interesting. Uh, Carlos Santana, uh, low number. Uh, Max Meyer, white border. Okay. You got two to go. Hey, just to let you guys know, um, I'm going to give instructions to my shipping team on this first case since there's all those other Easter eggs that I could have potentially missed. I'm going to make sure that those guys, uh, after they sort everything by team, just quickly go through the base cards and if I've missed anything, just leave and top load it. Um, I'm, at this point, I'm certain I probably missed at least one or two image variations. I had to have. If they're coming one in three boxes and I'm on box 10 and I've seen one. Uh, Juan Marichal, Jumbo, Gigantes. Ow. I know I caught the black and whites, at least a couple of those so far. Jordan Hicks, uh, low number. Yeah, it's just work. <laughs> I try not to put extra work on my team. I do my best on that, but I'm not always successful. Uh, black Chrome Refractor 75, Riley Green Tigers. That's a nice one. Uh, Tigers for Gears. Besides, in the grand scheme of things, it's only a few cases that we have to worry about. So, of course, Chad's probably uh, uh, probably churning in the back of his head. Maybe I should try to get more. <laughs> uh, Jaron Duran, low number. Davis Ricky. Tyler Stevenson, low number. Uh, 
That's an image variation. C.J. Abrams, Nationals. Only caught a second one. Uh, Nationals blowing Bruby. Combo spot there. It's funny, I got two Dalton Bar shows right next to each other. There's Ellie. Kodai Senga, uh, low number. Uh, PCA. Uh, that's also true, huh? Tell his low number. There's a Lawler rookie. Oh, the Duran Chrome versus his regular. Yeah, I definitely believe it. Savall, low number. Yeah, this definitely a break that will uh, put all your senses to the test, right? Uh, Sedan so Rafaela, uh, white border. How much of this did you open, Michael? Just one case or multiple? Dean Kramer, low number. Uh, Dylan C's Clubhouse Collection jersey for the White Sox. Two gears. Gary Sanchez, low number. Oh, Mike Schmidt, that's not a bad one to get. And a Carson Kelly white border for the Tigers. All right. <clears throat> one box remaining. Uh, one more uh, stamp buyback. Nelson Bryles for the Royals. Jeez. Careful on that one, bud. There it goes. All right. Dominguez base. Uh, Mickey Moniak, low number, Angels.
Sunny Gray Law Number Cardinals. Uh, Michael Soraka, low number. And Alec Thomas, Clubhouse Collection for Diamondbacks, going to Ram. So this case is nine relics, three autos. Three autos are all rookies, and the last one was pretty good. There's a base rookie, Evan Carter. You guys, Monty Grandal, low number, White Sox. Uh, Brandon Rogers, White Border Rockies. And a Caminero rookie again for the Rays. Ellie! One more Ellie. Uh, Joey Weimer, uh, low number of Brewers. Uh, PCA rookie. Whoops. Ah, come on, Ryan. Darn you. It's incredible how much shrapnel came from these packs over one case. I wiped down my table before I started this morning. Uh, Mauricio Dubon, low number, Astros. We got 125. Uh, Weston Wilson, uh, white border Phillies. Oh, almost uh, blew right by a Lawler rookie that I've been sleeping. Uh, Jonah Heim, low number. Uh, Luke Weaver, low number, last pack. All right, uh, we got a curse me Chrome to nine ninety nine for the Rays. Tampa Rays to Fox Marine, and that, my friends, is going to close out the break. All right, so I want to give you guys a heads up. There will probably be a couple of variations that I may have missed that are within the base cards. I'm going to ask my team to. Um, after they sorted everything by team to just take a quick gander at each of the cards on the back, just flip through them and make sure that I, uh, what I missed and what I did miss, I'll announce to you guys um, later on in the show. This is one of those time, one of these days where the guys are waiting for this break so that they can start sorting right away. I also realize I'm going to need a 5,000 count box to put these set, put these in instead of 32. All right. Uh, mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. uh, don't worry about recapping these. No progress. Mm -hmm. mm -hmm. Okay. Let's see what I got going here. Chrome buyback uh, image variation. 
more chromes. I'm going to buy it back. That's a color variation. Um, mm -hmm. uh, that's an image variation. 50th, black and white. 999, 999, uh, huh, huh, black and white, mm-hmm, 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 mm -hmm. and, mm -hmm. I'm going to put that with those, actually, okay, so we got those. Oh, no problem, Rick. I got another one coming up. Gives you guys uh, something to watch until uh, until live sports begin, namely uh, the other uh, two Champions League quarterfinal games today. Not a lot more than noise rocket going down my street. Sound like an old man every time I say that. I'm like, geez, I'm sounding too old man right now. Sonny, take that rock take that noise rocket somewhere else. Don't burn it down my street. wonder if I miss Caminero. Hey, hang on a sec, guys, before I do recap. Sorry about that, guys. I was giving, uh, giving instructions about if I missed anything here. All right. Uh, recap is ready for you. 2024 Heritage Baseball Ram Teams Case Break 1. All right, here's what we pulled out of here. Uh, these are stamp buybacks. Uh, each box had either an oversized card or a stamp buyback. These are the stamp buybacks we got. Uh, nobody really special. Bob Reynolds, Bill Milton, Ron Schuler, Jim Barr, uh, Jeff Zahn, and Nelson Bryles. Uh, your top rookies, uh, there are seven guys that I sleeved in this. Uh, Junior Cameronero, we find, found five base rookies of his. Evan Carter, we found eight of his. Uh, plus, we found a uh, purple chrome refractor. The first box had all of our purple chromes. That was the best one of the bunch. Uh, Pete Crow Armstrong, uh, we found seven base rookies of him. Henry Davis, six of him. Uh, Ellie De La Cruz, six Ellies. I think we found eight Dominguez. And uh, Jordan Lawler, I think we found six. Okay. All right, what else we got? Uh, we got some uh, numbered chromes here. The 999, South Relic, Zach Aloff, Mas Masataka Yoshida, Slade Chaconi, Curtis Mead, Refractors, the 575, Austin Riley, George Springer, and Shane McClanahan. Got a silver refractor 375 P. Core Armstrong and a black refractor 75 Riley Green. 
so there, uh, these are some of the variations I did find. I may have missed a couple. Um, once again, my team will let me know which ones I may have missed out on after they sort through the base cards. Uh, but I did find two image variations. I'm sure it's probably at least one, if not two more. Uh, Ronald Acuna and C.J. Abrams are the ones that I found. I did find a color swap uh, variation, Francisco Lindor. Found a couple of black and white photos as well, Sedane Rafaela and Martin Maldonado. All right, uh, memorabilia hits, we had nine of them. Uh, Clubhouse Collections, Jonathan India, Brandon Nemo, Reed Detmers, Justin Turner, Dalton Varsho, Jaron Duran, Aaron Nola, Dylan Cease, and Alex Thomas. And three autographs that we found. Found some decent ones here. All rookies. Slade Chaconi, Diamondbacks, Everson Pereira, Yankees, Pete Crow Armstrong for the Cubs. All right, that'll be the break. Thank you for joining in. Thank you for your support of Fire Hand. Congrats to our lucky hitters and break. Until next one. Hour 33. Not as bad as I thought it was going to be. I thought it was going to be close to an hour 40. Yeah, so just to let you guys know, when I do subsequent cases of this, I'm going to actually open up all the packs at once and then flip through the cards from the back first. Because if there's any variations, I'll be able to tell them that way. As uh, Michael pointed out, it might be a good idea to try it that way. That way I can't miss them the next time. And I want to mark this PCA for Sig C. It's one of the bigger rookie autos you can get. And Ellie would be awesome, but... PCA was a pretty good start. Oops, that's not what I want to do. Let's try and just uh, click these to delete them. Delete, that's better. Okay, so I know we're down to seven here. We're down to eight here. Give me just a moment, guys. Been a while. Obviously, it's been an hour and a half since I updated these uh, um, spots. Let me make sure I got this taken care of. Um, all right, so I got a team closer on Revolution 2. Let me see who's out there. Cats, Clippers, Heat, Hornets. These rockets are out. Let me do this. Sterling PYT one.
while putting up this list. I do know that there's an elite team I gotta mark off. Like the Raptors, okay. Such a, oh, like newsreels ones? Just split them up evenly. So I would say just like pull them aside and just put it in just go. Yeah. There's, there's not really much value on those. I mean, you know, like, you know, like oh, cards maybe. It's not market that your card. It's huge. Might sell for 50 cents. Oh, cool. <laughs> <laughs> and then they, have, they, they also replicated those MVP cards with the two players. You know, split those up equally. Yeah. I, I, I trust you. <sighs> yeah, I'm thinking the 32 may not be big enough. Alright guys, thanks for your patience. We're going to get this next case going here in a few moments. I just got to gather up your names and send out an email. at these teams here for basketball I, I want to get a filler going for one of these I'm just trying to figure out how I can best do it that makes it um, I guess in way somewhat equitable um, I know I got nine teams left in revolution so a 50 50 filler would be 43 50 a spot what if I did it 25 spots 25 spots nine winners would be 31 50 a spot If 
I did that, I would probably have to combo up the Knicks and the Clippers as a combo spot, pretty much as we would do in uh, Ram teams. Let me do that. I want to try at least. I want to get. Some, I want to get a filler posted to something to try to get another break going right away after Heritage. And I think Revolution is the best candidate. <clears throat> And I think I'm going to do the same thing that I did last time. The participants, the first spot outside the top eight will get uh, store credit for the spot of the... Uh Let's see. Blazers are still there. Heat and Hornets are still there. Pelicans are still there. Yep. Okay. Good. All right. And... Give you guys a link for this revolution filler. and teams in here we're just about ready to go Let's get it. All right, everybody. We're doing a 2024 Heritage Baseball Ram Teams Case Break 2. Thank you for joining in, and thank you guys again for your support of Fire Hand Cards. We appreciate you guys very much. Um, it's one thing I learned from the first case. Uh, the second case, what I'm going to do is I'm going to be opening up all the packs and flipping through the cards to make sure I don't miss any um, any uh, variations. There may have been a couple I missed in the first case that I'll announce to you guys once uh, I have confirmation of what I missed from my uh, sorting team. Um, 28 spots in the break. There's one triple combo team and uh, 27 solo teams in this break. All right, here we go. Good luck. All right, two clicks. Did two clicks last time, if I'm not mistaken. Uh, JB, 21, 14 top. Fox, Marine, bottom. Here we go. Two clicks. Once, twice. Jeff, back top. B pins are bottom. Bottom. 
Angels top, Yankees bottom, two clicks. Once, twice. All right, Orioles top, and the Mets bottom. Whoops, that's better. Okay, uh, Dave with the Padres, B pins or Mets, uh, Falker, Yankees, Foxco Marine, Angels, Mariners, Gator Lum, Braves, Gears, Reds, White Sox, Twins, Gump, Tigers, Royals, JB, Red Sox, Jeff Beck, Orioles, Jonathan Mansuto, Astros, Cardinals, and Blue Jays, Kazu, Rangers, Guardians, Kim Young, Sook, Cubs, uh, Leprechaun with the combo spot, Marlins, Nationals, and Rockies, M. Ozil, Dodgers, Mark Seal, Painting, Phillies, M. Johnson, Giants, Big Pardon, and Pirates, uh, Richard Merg, Brewers, Greg, Athletics, Song SK Diamondbacks and Webb Jr. Rays. All right. Some you slipped the wrong way. That's better. Uh, Evan Carter's first, um, <clears throat> what should we call it? Uh, oversize. I'm guessing that I'm guessing they may have autograph versions of those oversize. I'm not sure. All right. So once again, guys, I'll be uh, I'm gonna be opening these up like so. And this is gonna be the box with the purple. So yeah, let's do it this way. Just like the last case, top box on the left had all the purple refractors. I'm hanging in there, man. You know, Heritage Baseball's out today. It's eating up. It's it, it's eating up some uh, some day. Not a bad thing. See if uh, this box could have an autograph in it. Actually, all right. Let me just. I'm. I'm pulling the. I'm pulling these out. Uh, in fact, we do have a real one auto. I'm just going to show it to you right now. Uh, first box, one auto. AJ Smith Shaver for the Atlanta Braves. Going to Gear Lemon three. So what I'm going to do is I'm just going to pull out all the cards that would normally uh, show off and or sleeve, and then. Uh, and then we'll go on according uh, go on accordingly. Uh, Mackenzie Gore is a high number. And 
I'm pulling out all the purple chrome refractors, which I don't have to worry about doing once. Uh, Shintaro Fujinami is a high number. All the high number or, or low numbers, rather. 1 to 100 are the short prints. They're all turned around in this. Uh, Kevin Newman for the Reds. Uh, we got a variation here. This is a image variation. Owen White. Texas Rangers. For Kazoo. And if you look closely on the back, it says image right there, right above the card number. Oops. Of course, I stacked a whole bunch of... And then I'll go back through these one more time to make sure that I didn't miss any rookies or anything like that I need to sleeve. There's seven guys I've been sleeving today. Uh, Harrison Bader, high number, or low number. Uh, I got a white border here. Uh, Corbin Burns. Burns. Another white border, Whitey Herzog, Royals. Uh, let's see, uh, uh, low number uh, highlights, Lorenzen. I know this isn't the sexiest way to go through this break, but by the same token, I need to make sure I'm not missing any variations for you guys. John Carl Stanton, low number. Uh, low number, Kyle uh, Higashioka. Lane Thomas, low number nationals. This won't be quite as difficult going forward since I don't have to worry about purple chromes the rest of the way. Okay. All right, your purple chromes here. Uh, Emmett Sheehan, Jordan Adams, Brian Wu, Kyle Higashioka. And you're right, uh, very, uh, um, the chromes, they're using different photos, at least on some of them. Because the, uh, the Higashioka that we just pulled, the high number, the low number is a different photo. Uh, Big Gunner, Trey Turner, Clint Kershaw, Riley Green, Pete Alonzo, Paul Goldschmidt, Garrett Cole, Francisco Lindor, Aaron Judge, Mookie Betts, Luis Matos, Nolan Arenado, George Springer, Max Scherzer, Kettle Marte, uh, Bryson Stott, Zach Galoff, Quinn Priester, Yusi Kikuchi, Masataka Yoshida. 24, right? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7. So, <clears throat> there's those. Uh, your high numbers, Lane Thomas, Kyle Higashioka, John Carl Stanton, uh, Lorenzen's no-hitter, Harrison Bader, Kevin Newman, Shintaro Fujinami, Mackenzie Gore. All right, yeah, check through these just to make sure I don't have any other uh, uh, big rookies I got to sleeve here. Dominguez. Somehow I missed a regular uh, silver chrome here. 375 Byron Bucks and Twins. Gears. And this is why we go through them. <laughs> Uh, 
Okay. All right. So Dominguez is the only big rookie we had. Uh, Dolores Garcia, Jumbo. Uh, got a white border of Austin Hayes. Juan Yepes is a uh, low number short print. Uh, I got a chrome here. Uh, the 999 Joey Votto Reds. Reds for gears. Yeah, this is a really weird way of doing it, but I need to make sure I'm not missing any variations, like the missing signature here, Hassan Kim. That's a variation. Padres for uh, 3G Fleming. I'm certain I missed the uh, missing signature, missing facsimile variation in the first case, which, again, I'll tell you guys who it is once my team figures it out. That is my dirty work for me. <laughs> uh, I'll go back through these and make sure I um, sleeve any... Um, Sleeve any top rookies that I miss here. We got a memorabilia hit here, Joe Musgrove for the Padres. That's gonna be your hit for the box, 3G Flamia. Harrison Bader, low number uh, short print. Uh, white border is Samad Taylor for the Royals. So the white borders come to a box. In case you're wondering. Uh, Shintaro Fujinami, low number. Uh, John Carl Stanton, low number. Low number, Kevin Newman, Reds. Mackenzie Gore, low number nationals. Uh, low number Edward Julian, twins. Uh, low number JK Phillies. Uh, no other variations to be made aware of here. Okay, so put the, the numbers there. I'm going to just check through these and see what uh, 
big rookies I got here I got to sleeve out. There's Evan Carter. There's Dominguez again. At least all these cards are vertical, so it's easy to kind of just flip through these. At least all the rookies are vertical. There's Henry Davis. Okay, it's box two. Uh, just as up, guys. If you just got into the room, we posted a um, we posted a filler for Revolution Basketball. Uh, we're also in single digits on uh, both of our top Sterling cases. Uh, we have a Ram Teams case as well as a PYT case. Uh, we're also in single digits on our last Random Players case break of 2021 League Valiant Baseball. Uh, I got a buyback Ted Martinez here for the Mets. Nathaniel Lowe for the Rangers, uh, low number, short print. I uh, got, uh, oh, this is a um, Chrome Refractor to 575, Alex Verdugo, Yankees. To Falker 22. Uh, Lourdes Gurriel Jr., low number, Diamondbacks. Uh, low number Corey Jolks, Astros. Got a real one auto here. Uh, Ron Blomberg, guess what? Red ink, guys. Good old red ink. Yankees, Balker 22. Red inks are numbered to the year of the uh, of the version of uh, Top Heritage that we're doing, which is 1975. So 75. Red inks, always highly sought after. In the secondary marketplace, don't sell just because you got Ron Blomberg, Ron Ron, Ron Blomberg, and thinking, oh, that guy's nothing. They'll sell for more than you think. <clears throat> we'll definitely pay for your spot in a break and then some. Promise. Uh, Dolores Garcia, low number.
Got a white border here. Almost missed that one. Although I wouldn't have missed it if I was when I started looking through the other way, but still. Um, let's see. Uh, Freddie Freeman, low number. Nolan Arenado, low number. <clears throat> uh, Patrick Sandoval, low number. Uh, Luis Patino, low number, White Sox. Uh, white border of uh, John Gray, Rangers. Okay. That takes care of those. And just make sure I don't have any big rookies. I got to sleep. I'm sure there's going to be a couple. stack though. Dominguez again. Seeing three Dominguez's in three boxes. Uh, right now, no. Um, we're out of Flawless currently. I thought we would put an NT in the store, but uh, we do have some NT. We do have some NT. We'll hop back in the store for you uh, uh, probably Friday. Uh, Rod Carew, uh, Jumbo. I actually completely forgot that I had National Treasures in hand. But right now, out of Flawless Baseball. Uh, Clayton Kershaw, uh, low number. Excuse me. Uh, 
uh, gunner low number. Missing signature on the uh, front. This is a variation. Curtis Mead Rays. Second one of those we've seen already. Webb Jr.'s got it. This is a black and white Garrett Cole for the Yankees. So we had actually a black and white and a missing signature stuck back to back in the same pack. Once again, this is the reason why I do this so I don't miss any of, miss any of your variations like I probably did in the first case. Uh, Ty France, high number or low number? I always keep wanting to say high number, but it's actually a low number short print this year. Low number Alexis Diaz Reds. Yeah, Eli Morgan low number. Guardians. Uh, Michael Kopech low number White Sox. Uh, white border Jason Dominguez Yankees very nice. Uh, Matt Manning, low number, Tigers. Memorabilia hit here, Paul Goldschmidt, bat piece for the Cardinals, belonging to Jonathan Mansuto. Uh, Adam Frazier, low number, Orioles. Got a white border here of Kerry Carpenter, Tigers. Check these real quick. Make sure get all the big rookies that I need to get. Davis. There's Ellie. Let's say where'd all the Ellie's go? There's PCA as well. Okay. Box fiber. Uh, Tom Seaver, uh, oversize. It is what it is. Hey, you guys bought it. It's up to me to rip it.
Okay, uh, box five. Uh, Jordan Hicks, low number Blue Jays. Low number Jaron Duran, Red Sox. Low number Dean Kramer, Orioles. Got a memorabilia hit here, Jonathan India for the Reds. Bat piece, Reds for Gears. Gary Sanchez, low number Padres. Uh, got a white border, Clayton Kershaw, Dodgers. Uh, Tyler Stevenson, low number Reds. Uh, low number Kodai Singa Mets. Uh, Dansby Swanson is a chrome to 999 for the Cubs for Kim Young Sook. Rowdy Tellez, low number Brewers. Got a white border of Connor Joe. Black border is still white border. Still says white border on the back. Pirates. Uh, Aaron Saval, low number for the Rays. Uh, another uh, white border, John Carl Stanton Yankees. There's Camonero. At least the names on these are easy to read when you're looking at the bottom of these cards. They're written big enough. Otherwise it could be really bad. Evan Carter. Excuse me. Jason Dominguez. Ellie. PCA. I haven't seen, uh, I don't think I've seen uh, Jordan Lawler yet, which is kind of surprising. Just looking through the base rookies I pulled so far. Yeah, that's really, I haven't seen one of those yet. All right, uh, box six. If you guys, again, are wondering why I'm going through these the way I'm going through them, I'm just doing it to make sure I'm not missing any variations for you guys. Uh, Larry Bittner for the Nationals. Pretty certain in the first case I opened, there's probably a couple of image variations I may have missed, so... My team sorting the first break right now. Let me know what I missed, uh, and I'll announce them to you guys when I get the word on that.
Uh, I can't remember ever pulling one of a big name, to be honest. I don't think I don't think they buy like I don't think they buy back like ten complete sets and then stamp all of them and that's what they use, you know. Uh, can you do me a favor and send me an email, Heisman, please? Send me an email. I'll give you directions. But I need an email form, please. Thanks. Uh, the easiest way to do that, you can just respond to one of my emails to let you know that their, your break is about to begin. And just let me know what you got there. Uh, Luis Severino, low number Mets. Camilo Duvall, low number Giants. Low number short print. Thanks, man. Uh, Brandon Rocchio, low number Guardians. Uh, this is an image variation, Luis Arias, Marlins, uh, for Leprechaun. Yeah, it says image right above the card number there. Uh, the Amazingly Randy, low number. Uh, Craig Kimbrell, low number. Luis Garcia, low number. The Acuna is a white border. You know, it's funny. Um, oh, it says white border right there at top of the one. I almost missed that one. I wouldn't have missed it flipping them around, but I almost missed it initially. Low number Mitch Keller, Pirates. Uh, remember, Billy hit here, Austin Hayes for the Orioles. Uh, a little peeling on that bottom edge there. Uh, the Orioles for uh, Jeff Beck, 45. Uh, Joan Duran, low number twins. Uh, that is your chrome. The 999 Bo Bichette Blue Jays. Jonathan Matsuto. Got a white border. Um, Rangers there. I'm not sure who that is. Not sure who that is that they got. I know it's a Ranger. I'm just not sure which player it is. Ellie again. PCA.
All right, guys, halfway home. Steve Yeager, Dodgers, guy's a bum. Emma Zeal. <laughs> Gabriel Arias, low number uh, Guardians. Low number Jameson Talon Cubs. Cole Calhoun, low number Guardians. Got an autograph to it here. Uh, Jim Rice for the Red Sox. I like how they use this. I think they use the same image they used on his original 75. Uh, Red Sox for JB. If I Also, if I remember right, Jim Rice was on a quad rookie. Just a tiny uh, imperfection there on the bottom edge. JB 2114. Nice hit. It's a little details that matter, right? Martin Maldonado, low number Astros. This is an image variation, Tyler Soderstrom for the Athletics to uh, Greg. Good old uh, image, it says there on the back, next to his card number. Uh, Anthony Santander, white border Orioles. Leo Di Tavares, low number Rangers. Carrie Carpenter, low number Tigers. Tom Cosgrove, low number Padres. And there's a uh, Chrome to 999, Nolan Arenado for the Cardinals for John Mansuto. I gray low number nationals. Uh, I got a white border here, Christian and Carnacion Strand for the Reds. Okay. Yeah, check through here and pull out any top rookies I got a sleeve here. Yeah. Rookie. 
fingers. PCA. Alright, box eight. Uh, Burt Blylevin, oversize. Uh, Mickey Moniak, low number uh, angels. Woo, Space Mountain. Nice. <laughs> uh, Sunny Gray, low number cardinals. Uh, Michael Soraka, low number White Sox. Uh, Vladito, uh, bat piece for the Blue Jays, Jonathan Mansuto. Low number, Yasmani Grandal, White Sox. Uh, got a white border here, Stuart Fairchild, Reds. Jonah Heim, low number Rangers. Luke Weaver, low number Yankees. Uh, I got an image variation of Johan Rojas for the Phillies for Mark Sale Painting. Uh, 
Uh, low number Joey Weimer Brewers. Uh, Matt McLean, Chrome Refractor 999, or just Chrome the 999, sorry. Reds for Gears. Uh, white, bo uh, white Border of O'Neill Cruz, and by White Border, it's Black Border, they call White Border. It says White Border on the back, I'm not kidding. In previous years, they would do Black Borders, but they'd be numbered. Uh, Mauricio Dubon, low number Astros. And a true White Border, Jose Fairman for the Cardinals. Jordan Lawler. Mingus. Evan Carter. Uh, oversized Gunner. All right, box center. John Gray, low number Rangers. Uh, got a uh, chrome silver refractor with 375. Brian Wu, Mariners, uh, for Foxco Marine. <clears throat> Jeff Hoffman, 
Nick Pavetta, low number, Red Sox. I uh, got a black and white variation here. Edgar Navarro for the White Sox. Four gears. Uh, Anthony Santander, low number of Orioles. I uh, got a memorabilia hit here. Christopher Morrill for the Cubs. Kim Young Sook. And again, just a little damage here on that bottom edge. George Kirby, low number of Mariners. I uh, got a white border, Andy Rodriguez Pirates. Or M. Johnson. J.P. Crawford, low number Mariners. Zach Gallon, low number Diamondbacks. Uh, and image variation, Zach Loff Athletics for Greg. Yep. Uh, low number, Kyle Freeland Rockies. Uh, uh, black border, white border, Johnny DeLuca Rays. Shamanea, low number Giants. Another white border, Nolan Gorman, Cardinals. Okay. Uh, there's Camonero, rookie. Are you seeing cross side like I am right now doing uh, Heritage? Cross side looking at the screen. <laughs> Waller. Carter. Uh, PCA. Uh, William McCovey, Padres, oversize.
слюни. Box 10. Still plugging away here. Uh, David Bendar. Um, blah, 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 uh, low number. Got a color variation here. Riley Green for the Tigers. Going to Gump 22. And it says color right above the card number. Hence the variation. Freddy Peralta, low number, Brewers. Uh, Mitch Garver, low number, Rangers. Uh, for the Mets, Francisco Lindor, Jersey Piece. The Mets, the B Pinzer. Connor Joe, low number pirates. Uh, got a white border featuring Brian Wu, Mariners. Ryan McMahon, low number Rockies. Jonathan India, low number reds. Uh, got a um, chrome refractor to 575, Zach Loff, Athletics. Going to grade. Uh, the autos so far were uh, Jim Rice, a red auto of Ron Blomberg for the Yankees, and AJ Smith Shopper Braves. Three autos so far. Uh, Jose Altuve, white border Astros. <clears throat> Pablo Lopez, low number twins. Uh, Ronald Acuna, low number. Okay. We'll check through these for the top rookies. Uh, there was a red ink. The Blomberg was a red ink. That was New York Yankees. Ron Blomberg. Yeah, where are all the big rookies at? There's Henry Davis. Okay. See you go. Dave Nelson buyback for the Rangers uh, to Kazoo. Uh, 
Uh, just to let you guys know, I'm down two spots left on the Leaf Valiant um, case and four spots left on the Random Team's case of Sterling. Number John Carl Stanton. Low number Tommy Henry. Low number Jake Rogers. Kelly, Merrill Kelly, low number Diamondbacks. Mike Trout, low number. I didn't realize he had a low number there. That's going to be pretty decent. Low number JJ Blade. Uh, got a white border Pablo Lopez twins. Carson Kelly, low number Tigers. Uh, the memorabilia hits for the Gigantes, Luis Matos uh, for M. Johnson. Uh, Andrew Bellotti, uh, Phillies, low number. Uh, Mookie Betts, uh, white border, Dodgers. Dominguez.
Davis. Okay. Got one box left. Rick Dempsey for the Yankees. Stamp my back. Uh, yeah, I got the multicast on. So, yeah, Paramount Plus does a uh, multicast where it shows both games at once and it goes back and forth between which, uh, which game you're hearing. It's the greatest thing ever. If only they did this uh, during uh, group stage, like, uh, like the game mix where you just have all eight on one screen, it would have been great. But, alas, they don't do that. They do a Galazzo show where they, like, uh, Kick, kick around to the different games during group stage, but uh, Shohei Otani, low number. All right, last uh, hit is a memorabilia hit: Felix Bautista Orioles to Jeff Beck. So uh, both cases that we opened had three autos, nine relics. Jordan Walker, low number. Got a white border, Jordan Wicks, Cubs. What's up, Jeremy? <clears throat> Please send flowers to the Khan family for doing what I asked. Namely, getting Josh Allen locked up to a long-term deal. Harold Ramirez, low number uh, raise. You can tell him for once Ryan's happy with something they did. <laughs> I'm sure you'll have it high on your priority list. Uh, Carlos Santana, low number. SP. Uh, I got a white border here. Low number, Luis Camposano. I uh, got a silver refractor, Kyle Higashioka from the Padres. I uh, belong to Dave, 3G Flamia. Dominic Smith, low number nationals. <laughs> Alex Cobb, low number giants. Uh, Austin Hayes, low number Orioles. Okay. PCA.
Anthony Davis. Ellie. Okay, that was the last box. This time I did make sure I got all the uh, various variations and such by going through the backs of the cards first. We got a lot of, let's see, so we had two black and whites. Uh, we had five image variations, two missing signatures, and one color swap. That's strange, only two Camineros, three Jordan Lawlers in this case. The mix was a little different this time around than the first case as far as these guys are concerned. Well, Atletico's already got a lead. Atletico is always a tough team to play against. They'll frustrate the hell out of you. Both as a player and as, and as a viewer. <laughs> All right, guys. Uh, 2024 Heritage uh, Ram Teams Case Break 2. All right, here's uh, what we pulled. Top rookies, uh, we had a pair of juniors. Kevin Carter, six of him. Pete Crow Armstrong, six of him. Henry Davis, six of him. Ellie De La Cruz, six of him. Dominguez, seven of him, plus a white, bat, uh, white border, and three Jordan Lawlers. All I know is that when they show that footage, if they try to clip it in any way, shape, or form, they're going to get the hell suit out, suit out of them. They better be showing that um, unedited. That's all I'm going to say. You better have your better have your uh, ducks in a row before you show something like that is all I'm saying. 
Uh, the uh, 50th anniversary stamp buybacks. Ted Martinez, Larry Bittner, Steve Yeager, Dave Nelson, Rick Dempsey. Uh, Chromes, 999, Joey Votto, Dansby Swanson, Bo Bichette, uh, Nolan Arenado, uh, Matt McLean. Uh, refractors to 575, Alex Verdugo, Zach Aloff, Silver Refractors to 375, Byron Buxton, Brian Wu, and Kyle Higashioka. Uh, let's see, variations, a couple of black and whites, Garrett Cole, Negger Navarro. Uh, image variations, Owen White, Luis Arias, Tyler Soderstrom, Johan Rojas, and Zach Aloff. Uh, missing signatures, Hassan Kim and Curtis Mead, and then a color swap of Riley Green. All right, uh, memorabilia hits, Clubhouse Collections, Joe Musgrove, Paul Goldschmidt, Jonathan India, Austin Hayes, Vladito, Christopher Morrill, Francisco Lindor, Luis Matos, and Felix Bautista. And your autographed hits, AJ smith Shaver, uh, Jim Rice, and a red, hand numbered 53 of 75, Ron Blomberg for the Yankees. That'll be the break. Thank you for joining in. Thank you guys again for your support of Fire Hand Cards, and congrats to our lucky hitters in the break. Until next one. Shaved off about seven minutes from the first break. Part of it, of course, knowing a little bit better what I'm looking for. Atletico Madrid is just one of those teams, man. They get a lead. Uh, yeah, they number they hand number them on the front on the red inks. Um, Atletico Madrid, they get a lead. They'll just they'll sit on it, and there's fewer teams better at sitting on leads than Atletico. They play the most boring, conservative soccer you could possibly think of, but it gets results. I agree. I think most years they did red red ink autos as uh, uh, hand numbering on the front. They never they've never serial numbered those with uh, with the machine. They've always hand numbered those. Ever since two thousand one. Pretty sure I got something close to, if not sold out. Give me a couple minutes, though, guys. I'm gonna bring these, bring this break out to the other room, and see if I got any update on the, uh, on uh, what I missed in the first case. I'll be right back.
All right, guys. Yeah, uh, team's still working on the first break. So once I get word as to what uh, variations I missed in the first case, I'll let you guys know. All right. So great news. Our next break will be Leaf Valiant. I got that filler up for Revolution, guys. I'm going to try to get at least one basketball break, uh, basketball PYT filled up today. Um, the Revolution is a little bit cheaper to put together, which is why I did Revolution first. We still have a few teams left in Elite, but um, I'm going to do this. Let me see if I can get this uh, posted at least to, um, to the Facebook group here because just one of those deals I didn't, you know, it. I want to be able to try to get something going basketball-wise. We have a couple of PYTs that are getting close. Jeez, what the hell's going on here? Let's see if I can do it this way and see if it goes a little easier here. I'm having a hard time opening up a page here. Try this again. Jeremy probably speaks more Japanese than like 98% of the population in Indianapolis, so. If I had to guess, that's probably the case. <laughs> Yeah, basically the first uh, hour was basically commercial free. Jeez, it's taking this thing so damn long. There it goes. Sorry guys, give me a sec. Why does it let me do that? Yeah, screw it. I'll post it this way.
<sighs> Alright, hang on guys, I'm getting your names here for this break. Just finished downloading them. Alright guys, we've got Valiant going here shortly. All right, thanks, Doug. Ugh. Would it be safe to say that Jacksonville would be a cheaper place to live than uh, Indy, or is it about the same? Be a lot closer to the beach, which would be kind of nice. Excuse me. Don't forget, guys, we got a filler in the store for Revolution Basketball. I'm trying to get uh, one of those, at least one of those PYT breaks going today. Um, if we can get that one sold out, we could probably try to do something with the Elite.
Nice. Now, like I said, give them, give, give those guys their flowers. They did what I asked. I'm getting that guy locked down. Actually, I found out this was the third straight year at Jacksonville franchise tag somebody and then uh, was able to somewhat quickly get him uh, inked to a long-term extension. They did it two years ago with Cam Robinson, last year with Evan Ingram, and this year with Josh Allen. So. <clears throat> I mean, Josh Allen certainly wasn't one of the reasons why Jacksonville struggled down the stretch last year. He did his part. All right, uh, names and players are in here. Let me just do this and fix this up. And the Phillies are gone, tribute? Okay. There we go. All right, guys, we're doing a 2021 Leaf Valley Baseball Ram Players Case Break 8. Uh, thank you for joining in. Thank you guys again for your support of Firehand Cards. Uh, this is a 25-spot break. Each spot in the break gets you four randomly assigned players. And uh, two participants in the break will hit a free roll spot, and a free roll spot will get you $42 in store credit. That's the cost of the buy-in for this break. All right, uh, roll the dice. Determine how many times we randomize the list of participants and players. Good luck. All right, three clicks, old school. All right, uh, so from um, Song SK to the 1-1, one -one, these are your 25 names. Your names are in here four times each. All right, let's get it. Three clicks. One, two, oops, sorry, I missed it. Two, that's better, and three. All right, uh, Foxco Marine top and Justin Dahlke bottom. All right, your players got the two free roll spots at the bottom. Up top is Adley Rutschman. Three clicks. One, two, three. All right, free roll up top, Averson Ortega bottom. So Foxco Marines got one of the free roll spots. And sorry, I'm going to move uh, Foxco right here. <laughs> Perfect. All right, 3G Flamia, Justin. There's going to be more for Justin underneath. Uh, Brendan Williams got the other free roll spot. Congrats, Brendan. So I'll add your store credits here after we're done showing off the names here. All right, uh, 3467, uh, last couple of Justin says, Matt, down to Kazuaki. There's going to be more for Kazuaki beneath. And see, 67 to 100. Kazuaki, the tie bright. So let me get the free rolls uh, credit here for Brennan and uh, Brady. Thank you. 
All right, the uh, free rolls have been applied for those two winners. Congrats. And we get the rest of your names up here up on the screen. They each bought one spot and hit free roll. So they are free rolling with the other three names. Okay. Hence, the name of the free roll. Every single spot wins. <laughs> How you doing, Casey? Uh, Hebert Perez Orange 99 uh, for Casey. I uh, got a Navy at 75 West Cath. Uh, 32 of 75 for Kazuaki. Thank you. Same, same. Uh, Ryan Holgate, uh, Green Base Auto, non numbered. Uh, for Justin, uh, Orange 99, Colson Montgomery. Casey. I uh, got a Colton Kowser uh, purple auto, uh, 9 5, uh, 9 5 10, and the purple auto is number to 50 uh, for the 1 1. Kind of sad because right now this is the last of my Leaf baseball. We went through all that 2021 stuff that we got. Chad Chad had discovered a couple of Leaf Metal Jumbo cases he had in his attic. And we actually found uh, an opportunity to order some more of this Valiant, which we did. Um, past tense. And um, and same went, went with the Trinity to a couple of cases that we found. And it's all gone now. Uh, Ryan Cusick to 75. Casey? Uh, Noah Miller, pink. Uh, pink is number to 25. The 1-1. One, one. Andrew Abbott, green. Uh, for Crowley. Uh, Big Benny, green. For Jaw Rock. Oscar Colas, uh, Navy Blue Auto 9510. Or, I'm, almost, I'm hoping it's a 10. Uh, 3G Flamia has got Oscar Colas. It is indeed a 10 auto. All right, good. All right. That's two. Uh, Joe Rock, pink. Tie bright. Atletico's got two now. Uh, number to 25. Dortmund doesn't have a prayer tonight. Uh, Jose Ramos. Base auto. D&H Martin. Orlando Martinez, Orange 99, Justin Dalkey. Uh, Green Auto, Gabriel Moreno. Uh, Kazuaki. And Gavin Williams, Pink Auto here. Uh, for Jaw Rock. 
Whoops, that's not what I wanted to do. That's what I meant to do. There it goes. Uh, 9, 5, 10. Number to 25. Orange 99, Jose Perdomo. Song SKD3. Excuse me. Number to 99. Derek Curiel, Purple. Or Crowley. Number to 50. Navy Blue, 75, Steve Hajar. Justin Dalkey. Uh, purple, Andrew Painter, number to 50. Treater. Okay. And Big Benny, got an orange 9-5. Uh, this is our first duplicate name. Uh, for John Rock, 9-5-10, number to 99. Barcelona's on the board. At the Parc de Presents. Wow. That away section's going nuts. Gavin Williams, Orange 99. Another uh, duplicate name here. Jaw Rock gets this one. Green Auto, William Bergola. Timmy Mine. Uh, Max Muncy, Platinum Blue to 35. Casey. Uh, Navy to 75, Christian Hernandez. Casey. Uh, Orange, Robert Pawson to 99. Timmy Mine. 9510. <coughs> so, so far they've all been tens, right? That yeah, good. Navy, Aurelvis Martinez, 75. M. Johnson. Uh, Mick Abel, Green Auto. Justin Dalkey. Cooper, Kenny, Orange. Scares for life. Uh, Zach Mean Orange, the 99. Jaw Rock. Uh, got a red prismatic uh, proof, Colton Kowser. Which I believe is another duplicate name it is. The 1 1 gets this one. I think that's three duplicate names so far. Anthony Gutierrez is orange. Casey. 
Number to 99. And I got a pro set out of here, Luis Matos. Song is K83. That one's number to 15. Green Auto J. Allen. The 1 1. Uh, another Colton Kowser, Navy to 75. For the 1 1. Uh, got a uh, yellow, Matt McLean. Autograph. Very nice. That'll work. Uh, Matt McLean, Casey, congrats. Now, not too often I find graded yellow autos. I know they look gold, but they call them yellow. Uh, 9510, by the way. Marco Luisiano for Casey, number to 99. <laughs> they caress their Jackson holidays today. Riley Green, uh, base green auto. Treater. Uh, Orange Jesse Franklin, number 99. Uh, Justin Sesmat. Trey Sweeney Navy, 75. Boxco Marine. Got a uh, Orange Clear uh, proof, Jackson Job. Crowley. Green, Owen Cassie. Justin Dalkey. Uh, PED's Marte, Orange 99. Foxco Marine. Uh, Joe Mack, Platinum Blue to 35. 1 1. Purple, Michael Harris is second. Nice, the 50 for Justin Dalkey. Uh, Green Auto, Marco Luisiano. For Casey, repeat name, 9510. Ready to go. Samuel Munoz, this appears to be a black prism. If it is, it's number to five. Uh, DNH Martin's got this one. And this is the black prism number to five. Uh, Nick Gonzalez, uh, base green auto for Skiers for Life. Uh, I need to get the current one filled up first, uh, which I happen to fill it right now, Alan. I need to get one filled up before I post the next one. Uh, we'll bend our orange. Casey. Uh, Jack Leiter, 35. Ty Bright. Uh, 
Uh, Jay Allen. Uh, nine five. Four one one. Nine five nine auto. Dang it. Uh, Brady House, Green Auto. Uh, Kazuaki. Got an Orange 99, Sam Bachman. Casey. Uh, Navy Blue, 75, Brenda Beck. Right, and by excellent, you mean they just got blown up in the water before halftime, right? <laughs> uh, yellow to 10, self relic. Justin Dalkey. Uh, got a red prismatic here, Andrew Abbott. Proof, red proof, Andrew Abbott Crowley. So we have two different uh, red prismatic proofs. Nice. All right, got one box left. In other words, everything according to plan. Got a uh, purple to 50 Cody Moore set. Brennan Williams. Platinum blue 35 Jake Vogel. Song is KD3. Uh, Orange 99 Dalen Leal. For 3G Flamia. Uh, Orange and uh, Marcel Mayer. For 3G Flamia. Last card of the break, Jose Perdomo. Green Auto. For Song SK83. 9 5 10. Alright. Alright, that'd be the break. I have a recap ready for you. This is uh, 2021 Leaf Valley Baseball, Ram Players Case Break 8. Thank you for joining on the break. Here's what we pulled. All right. Uh, base screen autos. Ryan Holgate, Andrew Abbott, Big Benny, Jose Ramos, Gabriel Moreno, William Regola, Mick Abel, Jay Allen, Riley Green, Owen Cassie, Nick Gonzalez, Brady House. Uh, I got a trio of graded green autos. Jay Allen here is a 959. The others are 9510, Marco Luisiano and Jose Perdomo. All right. Orange 99, Hebert Perez, Colson Montgomery, Orlando Martinez, Jose Perdomo, Gavin Williams, Cooper Kinney, Zach Bean, Anthony Gutierrez, Marco Luisiano, Jesse Franklin, Noelve Marte, Will Bednar, Sam Bachman, uh, Dalen Leal, and Marcel Mayer. Uh, orange uh, 9510s, Big Benny and Robert Pawson. Uh, Navy Blue 75, West Kath, Ryan Cusick, Steve Hajar, Christian Hernandez, Aurelvis Martinez, Colton Kowser, Trey Sweeney, Brenda Beck. Uh, Oscar Colas 9510, number 75. Uh, purple to 50, Derek Curiel, Andrew Painter. Uh, Michael Harris II, Cody Morissette. 
Uh, Colton Kowser, 9-5-10, number to 50. Uh, Platinum Blue, 35, Max Muncy, Joe Mack, Jack Leiter, Jake Vogel. Pink, the 25, Noah Miller, Joe Rock. Got a pink 9-5-10 here, Gavin Williams, the 25. Uh, got a Pro Set, Luis Matos, Black Prism, the 15. Uh, got a yellow, the 10, the South Relic. Uh, yellow graded, a uh, Matt McClain, 9-5-10. Uh, got a black uh, Prismatic, the 5, a Samuel Munoz. And three production proofs. Colton Kowser, Red Prismatic. Andrew Abbott, Red Prismatic. And Jackson Job, Orange Clear. All right, that'll be the break. Thank you for joining in. Thank you guys again for your support of Firehand Cards. And congrats again to our lucky hitters in the break. Until next one. Okay. So we had eight duplicate names in the break all together. Right back, guys. All right, guys, well, we got another break. Sterling is sold out. Ram Team 6.
excuse me. Uh, I need to see some movement on uh, the basketball one first. I'm not just going to post a bunch of fillers and let them sit. I'm trying to get action filled up today. I need to at least see some movement on the revolution before I consider putting up another filler. which I'm getting no action right now in that revolution. Let me get your names here for the Sterling case. I'll be right back while I get those.
All right, yeah, it's back closer on the value mixer. Ah, shoot, let me find this. Uh, did I do one of these Monday or Sunday? Can't remember if I did. Worth a look. All right, um, you know, before we start to sterling, guys, um, this revolution filler isn't getting any action. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to pull the filler and put the teams back in the store, but I'm going to discount the remaining teams. All right, um, and let me, uh, sorry guys, I need a few more minutes because I'm going to, um, like I said, I'm going to be uh, um, adjusting some prices here. Um, Let's make sure that this is right before I continue. Yeah. 
I'm just going to round these up to the nearest dollar here. Let's see, calves are now at 27. Clippers at 21. Uh, the heat at 132. Hornets at 169. Harry San Germain just scored. Not a game there. Kings at 27. Uh, let's see. Knicks I have to manually adjust because... Oh, no. You know what? Stay at 22. Never mind. Uh, let's see. The Pacers at 42. And Pelicans at 81. All right, so those prices are to the nearest dollar on those. So with that, with the revolution back in the store, maybe I can always try something with the uh, impeccable. I'm gonna do that after this break. All right, maybe a filler for impeccable might move a little bit better. And let me go ahead and remove that. Uh, let me fix this bounty. Do we dare hit a barrel or knob for third for the third straight qualifying break? We'll, we'll find out right now. All right, guys, we're doing twenty twenty four top Sterling baseball uh, four box at Ram teams case break six. Thank you for joining in. Thank you guys again for your support of Firehand Cards. This is a 25-spot break. There are 20 solo teams, 5 combo teams. There are no nationals in the product, and the Diamondbacks are comboed up with non-MLB, so anything that's not baseball will go to that spot. Uh, roll of data determines how many times you randomize the list of participants and teams. Uh, the barrel knob bounty is in effect on this break. We can uh, possibly hit the barrel or not, barrel and or knob bounty uh, for the third consecutive break here. Uh, we've done it two consecutive times. 200 bucks on that uh, bounty. All right, here we go. Three clicks. <clears throat> Jaw Rock top, Foxcomb Marine bottom. One, two, three. Alrighty. Uh, Frank at the top, Jarrah Slats bottom. And Party San Germain just took the lead. Two quick ones to start the second half against Barca. Uh, Angels top, Yankees bottom. Three clicks. One, Two, three. Blue Jays top, Guardians and Twins combo at the bottom. I'm in the future. <laughs> Usually if you're streaming, you're not in the future. You're usually in the past. <laughs> uh, Ace Team Yankees, uh, Ben Rossa Braves, BRJ, Red Sox, CB Mac G Phillies, Doug Brown Tigers, Eugene Lee Angels, Frank, Blue Jays, Cardinals, and Reds, Foxcomb, Marine, Giants, and Dodgers, Gump, Mets, uh, Hasaruna, Rangers, and Rockies, Jaw Rock, Padres, J.R. Slats, Guardians, and Twins, Justin Sesmat, Astros, Mitsuaki, Pirates, Fisai 40, uh, Mariners, Athletics, and Rays, White Sox, Royals, and Orioles, uh, Shin, Nine, No, with uh, Diamondbacks and non-MLB, Timmy Mine, Cubs, Treater, Brewers, Marlins. All right, good luck, guys. Those are your squads. <clears throat> Uh, so it's safe to say that uh, the stream that you're watching may may or may not potentially be above or below board. <laughs> okay, okay. <laughs> Wasn't sure how I was supposed to interpret that. Or interpret that one. It's just slow, slower molasses.
Oh, I get it. I, I know. I know. It, I know what euros are, or pounds, or both. <laughs> All right, twenty twenties MLB All Stars or World Series champions. Yeah, I know. Isn't that the funny part? Uh, Tops All Star Rookie Cup team and postseason performers. Postseason performers and stat leaders. Uh, more postseason performers and other World Series champions. Three postseason performers, two World Series champions, one each, 2020 MLB All-Star, All-Star Rookie Cup team, and stat leaders. All right, uh, postseason performers first. For the Phillies, Trey Turner, Bat Jersey Auto 25. Uh, Philadelphia Phillies for CB Mac G. <coughs> Postseason performers, two. Dortmund ain't scoring three goals in the second half against this team. Just consider that bet a sunk bet right there. There's your uh, one of one, Reese Hoskins for the Phillies. Letter off the back. Uh, that's the letter O off the back. It looked like a U, but it's actually an O. It just cut it off a bit. There's your Uno de Uno for the case, CB Mac G. And the third postseason performers. Hoskins. <laughs> For the Astros, Roger Clemens, dual jersey auto, 125. For Justin Sesmat. He's my dirty ball player right now, damn it. <laughs> World Series champions. Reese Hoskins didn't come to Milwaukee to make friends. He came there to make money. Number to 10, got uh, John Smoltz here. Two bat pieces and a jersey piece. Uh, Atlanta Braves for Ben Rossa.
All right, World Series champions one more time. Excuse me. Spencer Strider, 18 of 25. Really? That's right, they did one in 22, huh? The Strider was actually on that squad. Alright, so be it. Ben Ross has got the Braves yet again. Trace Moss, uh, 2020's MLB All-Stars. <clears throat> That'll work. Uh, number five and five for the Padres, Juan Soto. Got a quad relegado. Uh, the Padres, Jaw Rock. Tops All Star Rookie Cup team. Uh, number to ten, Anthony Rizzo, Triple Relicado, New York Yankees, Ace Team. And stat leaders is the last one. Uh, number to ten, Christopher Morrill, uh, triple relic auto cubbies for Timmy Mine. That's all eight. The heater gone to Revolution. Awesome. Thanks, Justin. <clears throat> Hopefully a few more teams will go with uh, with the discounts I just put in on those teams. Since the filler wasn't going, I figured I might as well try a discount. Actually, I did that after Chad suggested it. Alright. Alright, guys. Here's your recap of what we got here. Um, number to 25, Trey Turner. Uh, and Roger Clemens and Spencer Strider. Uh, number to 10, John Smoltz, Anthony Rizzo, Christopher Morrill. Uh, number to 5, Juan Soto, a quad here. And your 101 was the letter off the back of Reese Hoskins, the letter O off the back of his jersey. All right, that's the break. Thank you for joining in, and thank you guys again for your support of Firehand Cards, and congrats to our lucky hitters in the break. Until next one. Don't forget, guys, we got a PYT case break of Sterling available with a handful of teams still remaining. Oh, Barcelona just nodded it. Yep, just saw that. Going through the recap when uh, that happened. Now Mbappe's got to get you the winner.
and or Dortmund needs to start putting in some work for you. All that you need is to get one and uh, put in some of the seeds of doubt, right? So we got a couple teams moved here. All right, so Pacers gone and the Heat are gone. Thanks, guys. Puts us down to just seven. All right. Um, yeah, we'll try a filler for Impeccable instead. We'll do that as a hybrid filler, I suppose. this yet yes So it'll be Chiefs and Tech. We'll do the same thing as before. Chiefs and Texans will be numbers, and the other teams will be awarded out in full. Did you take Eagles? Or is it done? Let me double check. Or are you in the middle of trying to check out? Let me put it back in, Greg. Are you sure? Okay. I could put it back in if you want it. It just makes the filler that much cheaper. Stick it back in? Okay, give me a second. That's what she said. Did it do? Psh. <laughs> Hang on a sec. Put this back in the store. I can, no problem. Yeah, let me know when you haven't purchased, and then I'll uh, set the filler up from there. I can wait a minute. That was the easiest that's what she said in the history of that's what she said. I'll be right back.
All right. Uh, the Eagles are taken. Sweet. Okay. No, no worries. Hey, it makes the filler that much cheaper, so I got no gripe with that whatsoever. It knocks it down a buck and a quarter a spot. Actually, hold on. I got to take away a spot here. Actually, it, marks it down, knocks it down a buck, so it'll be 17 instead of 18. Hey, every little bit helps, man. Every little bit helps. And I see we got a team closer in lead as well. Uh, looks like the Rockets are gone in Elite 5. Okay. All right. Jeremy, is TK calling me from the 904? Seriously, I'm getting a 904 area code right now. Let's see, so this will be break seven. Should be 82 spots. I'll still keep it 17, that's right. Okay. Give me 82 spots, not 83. Update. All right, guys. So the hybrid filler for impeccable football is up. So 76 spots get a left side serial number for Chiefs and Texans. The seven, spot 76 will be 76 through 99. And then uh, six teams will be awarded out in full. Okay, so there's that.
Okay. Alright guys, got a handful of teams left on uh, Revolution. Oh, yeah, I gotta mark that down, I'll sleep down to six. Excuse me. Three two Barca. So it was one nothing was it one nothing Barca at the half. PSG scores two quickies. And Barcelona comes back with two more. Man, this is this is like the epitome of world class soccer right here. And we still got eight teams left on top Sterling, guys. <clears throat> Angels and Yankees are both available. A lot of good teams still left there. Some of you guys were asking about PYT for Sterling, so I know Chad wanted to try to make that happen.
so it's nowhere's got it yet. Okay, just making sure. Um, should I just remove on this sheet too? Should I remove, put the top sterling teams or uh, tops um, tribute teams here? So that's tops tribute number six. All right, main teams for tributes up there as well. Go. And then uh, just as a friendly reminder with regards to um, Immaculate Basketball, not only can you win your way into Immaculate Basketball in the uh, Prism Blaster box that's up right now, you can also win your way in through the inner cases of Revolution as well. Dortmund got one back, 82nd minute. It's two to one now. You know, it's funny when a team scores a goal and then like the team that gave up the goal insists on holding the ball, like the referee's not going to keep the clock running on a goal scored. I'm just saying. That always cracks me up. Like there's some kind of gamesmanship there. It's not. The bookies always win, man. Sometimes you get sometimes you get over on them, but not often. Uh, down seventy nine on the filler for um, the impeccable a hybrid filler there.
Ooh, sorry guys. There's the Elite case there. Um... Maybe this might be a good time to take my break, grab a bite to eat, and come back. Yeah, so the rain teams in Revolution have been discounted. Uh, we still have a handful of teams left in Sterling PYT. Uh, tribute teams are up on the screen as well. Other breaks that uh, we can fill up that are relatively inexpensive include uh, Prism Racing. Uh, Premier League Soccer. Exactly. So those would be a good couple of possibilities to try to get going. We got uh, some more spots gone on the uh, hybrid filler. Definitely get that one rolling as well once that fills up. So far, it's that one's looking pretty promising. All right, I'll go ahead and take recess then. Probably be a good idea. Okay. Let's see. Uh, call 220. I'll see you guys in a bit. Thanks much.
Hey everybody. Uh, I do have a team closer on Revolution. Let's see who's out. Cavs are out. Uh, just heads up, the remaining teams on Revolution have been discounted 15%. Got a spot closer on the value mixer as well. Team closer on five star. Hybrid fillers at 61. So let's see, we moved, what, 21 spots so far in that hybrid filler? So about a quarter of them. Uh, also, this has up, guys, and that Prism Racing, uh, when that one fills up, I'll be pulling those three boxes from a fresh case. I also have a handful of teams left in Top Sterling PYT1. Those teams are listed up on the screen. Same goes to Topps Tribute Baseball, PYT6. Uh, don't forget, guys, there are also uh, two ways you can uh, win your way into the Immaculate Basketball case. You can win your way in through the next uh, Prison Basketball Blaster box. You can also win your way in through 
the Revolution random uh, basketball. Uh, so in the Revolution, one spot will be awarded in that one, and two spots will be awarded in the blaster box. Uh, still six teams each on Elite and Revolution. <clears throat> uh, we're at 21 on our um, NFL value mixer. Oh, by the way, guys, um, <clears throat> so there were a total of uh, four um, variations on uh, Heritage Case Number 1 that um, I missed when I was doing a break. Um, I found two image variations, or a total of five. The three that I didn't see that were later discovered by the sorting team. Uh, Curtis Mead, Owen White, Freddie Freeman. So, uh, Rays, Rangers, and Dodgers. Uh, there was also a missing signature variation for the Braves of Ronald Acuna that was out of case one. So just a heads up there. Um, see, on case one, 
So, um, Kim Young Sook had the Braves at Acuna. It's coming your way. Uh, Dodgers, five side 40 to Freddie Freeman, image variation. Rangers, Greg, uh, with that image variation. The Rays, Foxco Marine, uh, for the Curtis Mead.
<laughs> All right, guys, come on, we're gonna get filled up. <clears throat> Got some good teams left on these two basketball PYTs. Yeah, we still got spots available in the hybrid filler to fill out this immaculate, or uh, rather impeccable football. And yeah, that break is uh, NFL Shield Bounty eligible, don't forget. And six teams in that uh, break are going to be awarded in full in the filler. <sighs> so I got some teams left top strolling baseball that PYT case that one was just posted this morning I'm guessing some of my uh, East Coasters will be getting home pretty soon if they're not already.
Oh, I got to see him closer on Sterling. Let's see who's out. Uh, the Padres, thank you. Yeah, it seemed closer on tribute as well. Thank you guys very much. So he was out there. Uh, Angels, A's, Braves, Cardinals. Diamondbacks are out there. Thank you. All right, a little movement here. A little movement. Motion creates motion, right? Ooh. Uh, still just six teams left on Elite and Revolution, guys. We also have another value mixer in the store, a football value mixer.
Alright. Oh, got another team gone on Sterling. Awesome. Down to six now. Uh, who else is out? Middlebirds, Diamondbacks, Rays, Red Sox. Looks like the Reds are out. Chase and Ellie, good luck. And participant picked up the Reds. Thank you very much. Yeah, see if there's a way I can fit a third uh, post it note on here. Red Sox and Yankees. I can tell you guys that none of our cases had produced Nelly De La Cruz out of top sterling yet, so. And our participant uh, picked up the Reds there. Good luck. Hopefully, uh, this case will be the one. And don't forget, guys, you still have that filler available from Peckable Football. It's a hybrid filler. Six teams are going to be awarded out in full. And then uh, two teams, our numbers teams, will be Chiefs and Texans. We moved about a quarter of the spots in that hybrid filler already. We posted that one maybe an hour and a half ago. That's true. Not in tribute either. That's right. Yeah, Ellie's a tough cookie to pull. We pulled one decent rookie auto at Heritage today. We pulled Pecor Armstrong.
All right, guys, what are we going to fill up next? we got three PYT breaks there, are six spots remaining, uh, plus we have the filler for Impeccable Football. You know, a lot of you guys are just settling in after work, especially East Coasters, even your Midwesterners as well. Keen to get some action going for you. Uh, the Revolution teams have been discounted 15% from their original price. I believe it's next week. It is coming out pretty soon, though. 23, 24 Origins. I believe it's next week. Because there's only two new releases this week. Uh, one release was today, Heritage Baseball, and then Friday it's uh, Topps uh, UEFA Soccer. I believe Origins is the following Wednesday. We don't have any in hand yet, if that's what you're wondering. But I believe it releases Wednesday of next week. Actually, I can disconfirm that. It's going to release Friday. It'll be a Friday release. I guess it got pushed up. I thought it was next week, but it got pushed up to this Friday. Topps Chrome Black baseball releases a week from today. They decided to push Topps Chrome Black as an early season release this year as opposed to a late season release. That may actually be good for that product. Unfortunately, they're putting out Recon Basketball this year. That comes out in a couple of weeks. That product should never see the light of day again, ever, at all, under any circumstances. Just my opinion. <laughs> oh, no doubt. It is definitely capstone level, isn't it? <laughs> I mean, it's nice to get the two autographs a box, and every once in a while you get a nice rookie jersey auto, but there's a lot of products that offer nice rookie jersey autos, you know? Just my personal opinion on it, I guess. Oh, Flux? Yeah, it's got like that kind of, it's a chrome product, it's got like that green kind of tint to it, which is kind of weird. They do have a lot of, a lot of low-numbered color in that, though, which is kind of nice. So I was doing case breaks of that last year, you pull like three or four uh, numbered parallels, 99 or less in each box. So uh, the amount of numbered parallels added up, that helped out, that helped out in the bottom line a little bit if you bought a team. Is it the greatest looking product in the world? I mean, it's up for debate. I would put Flux above Recon. <laughs> Not much higher than Recon, but higher.
I can tell you guys right now a hybrid filler for Sterling Baseball with number one would be like 80 bucks a spot. I would do Angels, Yankees as the 25 numbers and then the other four teams as full teams. 29 spots, $80 a spot right now. Yeah, just throwing it out there just kind of as a suggestion. If a couple more teams go, that kind of helps. But the Rays sitting there at 29 bucks, it's like one of those deals where you buy a hybrid filler spot and then you get the Rays would be kind of crappy. Yeah, Recon, Zenith, and Capstone all kind of look alike, don't they? <laughs> Just packaged differently. I mean, Zenith is one six-card box football. Basketball, it's a box box. And Capstone, ugh. I think Caps uh, Capstone is so bad they didn't even bother trying to repeat it in 2023. Smartest thing they ever did. <laughs> Yeah, just a handful of teams on uh, three breaks, guys. And we got hybrid filler spots available for impeccable football. This break is uh, NFL Shield Bounty eligible. It'll be at eighteen fifty when we run this break. That bounty's got to hit sooner or later, right? I got four breaks in the store that are Super Factor Bounty eligible. Next time we do a bounty qualifying break, there will be at 1800.
All right, uh, Angels and Yankees are left in Sterling. Braves, Diamondbacks, Rays, and Red Sox as well. Uh, the Revolution teams were discounted 15% a little while ago. We moved a few teams since uh, we put those discounts in place. Got some really inexpensive teams to help get that one filled up, guys. You guys want to get into something cheap, that's a great option. Or if you want to get a big team, that's not going to break the bank. I agree, Ed. That does make no sense. I assume the package didn't uh, get to you today, which is a shame. A damn shame. Cause I know that went out yesterday. Really? Let me go check on it, Ed. I want to see. I want to see what I see on my end. But I, I believe you a hundred percent. I want to see what's going on with it. I'll bring it back.
Yeah, so what I'm seeing on my end, uh, Ed, is that uh, it was um, it was dropped off by one of our guys yesterday. I'm going to get confirmation. Andy was Andy was the only one not here today. Um, he would have been the one that probably dropped it off. I know, I know. It's it, it's it's a damn shame too because that's you know it's not like you're it's not like you're paying if you pay you're not like you're paying with change out of your couch cushions you know what I mean that's that's a sizable amount of money you're paying so. Yeah, Andy told me he dropped it off about 145 yesterday. So there's no reason why it shouldn't have moved. That's just it's awful. But I do have a copy of the tracking number here, Ed. We'll keep we'll keep tabs on it, and hopefully uh, hopefully by tomorrow it should be in your neighborhood, your area of the world. Yeah, because usually express cutoff is like around 4 o'clock, typically, at our post office. We got it there way before then. There's no reason why I it shouldn't. It, um, my hope is that maybe it missed a scan and it's only one day behind, you know. It's more like Kami USPS. <laughs> Truth of the matter is it probably would have been about the same rate to do UPS next day, or, but I don't have any next day or envelopes. I'm going to have to go to UPS store and get some of those. Make a, make a uh, targeted switch, perhaps, with regards to next day or shipments on single cards for you guys that wish for it. May cost a few dollars more, but UPS seems to be a lot more reliable in terms of uh, rush services. Uh, we got just a handful of teams left still on, our, on two under two basketball PYTs. Sterling baseballs down to a handful of spots.
I do have some spots moved on the Prison Blaster Box at 18. Uh, that Blaster Box will award out two spots towards the Immaculate Case. You can also win your way into the Immaculate Case in the Random Team's eight box cases of Revolution Basketball. One spot each will be awarded there. So a couple different ways for you to win your way into Immaculate. Uh, still a handful of teams left on Tribute, too. So 11 teams left. Oh, you got it, J.D. My pleasure. I, th I, I won't discount the opportunity for us to get more. I'm just hoping that we do. I can't make any guarantees that we will. I'd love to see some more, to be honest. Hang on, guys. Sneeze coming. It's better. Yeah, we blew through that. Uh, the random players format in the old Leaf uh, baseball products actually really, really, uh, really, really kind to you guys, I think. More importantly, we found a way to be able to move uh, Leaf product for you guys in a more uh, orderly fashion. Not just baseball, but we've also experimented with the random player format with football, too. Uh, we've got another spot closer on the blaster box at 17.
Hey, anytime you get a free roll spot, that's always a good day, right? Being on a free roll is the best thing you can possibly do. Yeah, and some of those training patches are really nasty. The funny thing about training patches, though, is that sometimes they'll use, like, uh, like uh, team anniversary patches and a uh, time that player didn't even play for the team, but still pretty cool nonetheless. Like, you look at some of them, it's like, this, this patch was from 2019, and this guy got drafted in 2021. <laughs> You know, this is one that came to my mind the other day. Um, the Blue Auto of Big Benny, because they were mentioned 2021. I don't know if you guys remember the Blue Auto of Big Benny and Bowen Draft. Was that Borat one ever found? Don't remember hearing about that one for a long time. I didn't realize five star moved a bunch of teams at seventeen. Uh, don't forget, guys, we also have an NFL football value mixer in store today.
Brewers at Reds is in rain delay. Womp, womp, womp. I'll be right back, guys.
Probably. <laughs> Probably. So I got a handful of teams left on our two basketball PYTs on Sterling. As usual, I always forget when I mute myself and then forget to unmute myself. Right? <laughs> I got a lot of you guys that are home now. Uh, if you guys just got on, just a heads up, I uh, cut prices on Revolution about 15%, the remaining teams that are left there. We moved a couple of teams since that price cut.
Yeah, lots of shuffling between PSA and eBay. <laughs> yeah, so I guess uh, big news coming out about uh, Golden Auctions being sold. An announcement came out this morning. I guess now there's some sort of alliance between eBay and them. That's what it sounds like. Start getting buyer premium upcharges. <laughs> what? Why him? sports. I'll be right back guys, I gotta check something.
Are you thinking that all the all the all the cheap listings are going to go to uh, have buyer premiums on them? I'm not sure if eBay would go that route. I highly doubt they would go that route. Let me put it to you that way. Now uh, we do have a team closer on Revolution. Thank you guys. Who's out? Uh, Clippers are out. Okay, it's one team closer. That cow is the goat. Yeah, you can use AI for your descriptions now, although I would say the AI descriptions aren't particularly great. AI descriptions are good to get you started, then you can edit, then you can edit them from there. Actually, I'll just do it this way.
Sorry guys, I'm trying to look for something here. All right, still a five on Revolution, and six each on top, Sterling Downers Elite. Got a spot closer on the uh, value mixer. It's at 20 now. Excuse me again, sheesh. All right, back guys.
Alright guys, like I said, we got Revolution close. It's down just five. Got a couple of good teams left still. And a couple of inexpensive teams. Don't forget that Galactic can show up for any team. Big or small. Come on, guys. I'm wanting to squeeze one more break out of it. At least one more break today. We had a bunch of spots moving the impeccable filler earlier. Kind of dry right now, to be honest, Mike. Trying to get a break filled up. Heritage was fun today, two cases that we opened. Uh, another thing I encourage you guys to check out uh, is um, we do have uh, picker player auctions uh, for Heritage that are on, that's on our uh, that's on our firehandcards.net site. And uh, the auctions for those end on Friday. So check that one out. Pick up, Try to pick up favorite players there. I believe the participant who buys the most number of players gets a, um, a Vladito jersey, and then I believe we're also doing a box giveaway as well amongst everybody that buys uh, spots in that break. All right. <clears throat> yeah, earlier I had it like at eight teams for Revolution, I think it was, or nine teams, and I tried to do a filler. Nobody would touch the filler. So Chad's like, pull the filler down, put the teams back in, discount them 15%. So that's what I did. Did move a few teams in that fashion. We moved four of the nine teams at this point that were left. Yeah, top Sterling, a bunch of teams were picked up this morning. We got a handful of the bigger ones left, and a very small one.
All right, hang on, guys. Chad wants me to uh, take care of something here. Hey guys, I just did another discount, a further discount on uh, the Revolution teams. Let me give you the new prices here. Alright, so the Blazers are now at 135. Uh, the Hornets are at 149. And let's see, the Kings are at 24. The Knicks are at 16. And the Pelicans, I think, are at 69. Yeah. All right, so those are some uh, discount prices there on the Revolution. Do have a spot closer on the uh, impeccable filler as well. That's true, huh? I saw that Jackson Churro was leading off. The Bill Gates weather machine. <laughs> There's a lot of conspiracies I believe in. That's not one of them. <laughs> That's too much, Doug. That's way too much.
right. And Chad asked me to do a couple other uh, couple other manual discounts here on another break. So Diamondbacks are going to be discounted here to 199 on Sterling. In Sweden. <laughs> Down to 19 for the Rays. And 199 on the Red Sox as well. Getting those updated right now. My thinking is that if we can get the Diamondbacks, Rays, and Red Sox sold at the discounted prices, we can run a numbers filler for Angels, Braves, and Yankees. rocket going down my street I ah, got another few teams gone revolution that seemed to work uh, Hornets Knicks and Pelicans are left and Pelicans. Uh, the Hornets are at 149. Uh, Knicks are at uh, 16. The Pelicans are at 69. And next one is... Yeah, in fact, I can pretty much uh, virtually guarantee for you guys on top Sterling, if the three teams that we just discounted got pick, get picked up, I can run a 25 spot filler for the other three. The Hornets are now gone. Beautiful. Thank you, Justin. Thank you, everybody, picking up those spots. Uh, just to let you guys know, um, before I pay my uh, tithes to Mr. Mouse tomorrow, um, from home, I'm going to check and see if uh, Tops posts a checklist for the Top Soccer. If they do, I can try to create uh, some pre-sale listings for Friday as far as uh, probably random teams. I don't think PYT is going to be in the question, at least right away, with regular Tops. But um, definitely try to get a few uh, random teams breaks um, available for you guys for Friday. All right, so two teams are left in Revolucion. Got a spot closer on the impeccable filler. It's at 59 now. Uh, right now, that's the only football breaking in store that we have that's uh, eligible for the uh, NFL Shield bounty. It's in a filler, so just a heads up. Yeah, a couple of fairly affordable teams left. Uh, the Pelicans are now left in Revolution. Knicks are gone. Don't forget, there's Galactics for everybody. And are available for all teams. Galactics are the great equalizer in Revolution. I'll be right back, guys. Let me make sure I'm going to pack a break their sleeves in case that revolution is indeed what we do next.
want to show you guys something real quick. Um, this is just a friendly reminder when uh, we're doing breaks that have a uh, random numbers filler um, uh, component to it. Just question everything. Question everything. Put down everything. There's something in there. So I think this is right that Josh did. And so there was a David Cone card that was number 7 of 25 that was in the numbers set. For some reason, it didn't mark it down. It ended up going to the Mets. The reason why I know that is because it ended up in the same card. So I just want to make sure, just to emphasize, like if you see something that feels like it's a miss, uh, something's missing, you know, I put down a number, but you can't find that number, just, just ask me. There's a point where you probably would have done something else. Sometimes, it's one of those things that I tell people sometimes, and I tell myself this, is that it's like the old saying, seeing fancy and fortune and trees. Sometimes you look at something wrong with them. Oh, so I'm not that point right now. <laughs> That's why we're just looking for here. Just, just to make sure. Oh, I can't find a... Uh, so, uh, Joe, Joe Pat, and Noah Miller. Noah Miller, I think, might have been a graded one, perhaps, or a slot one. Um, I, I, I know, I know, Joe, I know Joe Pat. You can always, um, you can always check the video. The video's posted. You can see what color it is. I'm I've got through them all. I'm wondering if something got left behind somewhere. Or I brought everything out. out. Steve grabbed one. Which I know I made up one on. But I don't know if it's a good grade. Did you put in the international already? No. Yeah, the one one was international, right? Yeah, the other thing I would do is look up the video. You can watch the video and see what color it is. That might actually help a little bit, too, because you can just look at the video sometimes. So it over. I but I can assure you, I know Joe Mack was pulled in that break. I only remember it because of the other way to do it. So. Okay. Uh, Pelicans are the last team staying on Revolution. Pelicans, last team stay on Revolution to get it going, guys.
I just gave one more discount to Pelicans to 59, guys. Just waiting for it to update. There it goes. I'm trying to remember what the original price on Pelicans was. I want to say it was 89. 95 actually. So that's a significant discount, guys, on the Pelicans. Let's fill it up and get running. That is the rock bottom I can do on Pelicans. All right, been bought. We got a break. Hooray! Uh, just a heads up, guys. If we can get the uh, discounted teams in Top Sterling bought, that would be the uh, Diamondbacks, Rays, and Red Sox. I can run a 25 spot filler for the other teams.
send. Yeah, guys, get someone going here in a moment. Still have 59 left in the um, the impeccable filler. Let me repost that or repin it. There it goes. Okay. All right, let's get this one rolling. It'll take a minute to get even so much as get the boxes out of here. It gives you guys time to get in a room. All right, here we go. All right, guys, we're doing a 23-24 Revolution Basketball. Uh, pick your team case break number two. Got it filled up, finally. Thank you for joining in. Thank you guys again for your support by our hand cards. We appreciate you guys very much. Uh, let's see what this uh, Masters got for us. 16 boxes of Revolution Nuts. Put these two boxes here in the front. That way I can get the rest of these showing on the screen. Okay. Alright, box one. <laughs> Chad will do that. I don't have that kind of time. I've been waiting an hour and a half for a break to fill up, so. Don't have time for rational rational ideas like the one you just mentioned. <laughs> Uh, Keontae George Ricky and Emmanuel Quickly Groove. There's our first Wemby in the form of a Rookie Revolution insert for Calicus 56. Uh, Fractal Donovan Mitchell. Jalen Wilson Rookie and Kate Cunningham Groove. Shockwave Jet Howard. Uh, your first numbered parallels uh, uh, impact 149J90 for the Pistons. Uh, belonging to Blake Wendell.
Jay Howard, rookie. Uh, got a liftoff sunburst. Scoot Henderson for the Blazers. Going Dorian. That will be number 75. Jason Tim, Supernova, a Jet Howard Groove. Maxwell Lewis, rookie. Uh, Anthony Davis, Groove. Uh, Vortex of Asar Thompson. Uh, Fractal Vortex, Cam Whitmore. And your first auto is for the Hawks. It's Kobe Bufkin going to Fool. Rookie Auto. Okay. That's the first one. Yeah, I did spin the case, actually, although it was only 180 degrees. Uh, Craig Porter Jr. rookie, GG Jackson the second fractal. Rookie Revolution Keontae George, Kate, or that's rather than a Sar Thompson group. I thought that was Kate for a second. That's a Sar. Jay Z Pete's uh, Jarris Walker rookie, Groove and Mellow Ball. That'll work. We found you one there, uh, Calicus 56. That is a galactic supernova of one Victor Wemayama. That is how it's done, ladies and gentlemen. Congratulations. Bam. Muy bueno. They do Galactics of all the base inserts and uh, base cards, so I think there's probably like however many different inserts of Wemby. I think there's four or five plus this base card. It's a winner winner right there. Winner winner. Uh, Shockwave, Jaime Jaquez Jr. Fractal Vortex, Case Wallace. I believe the boys over on the, uh, I think it was a whatnot feed, uh, got them, uh, pulled a, uh, Case and Wallace, uh, Galactic, uh, the other day. Julian Phillips, rookie. Uh, got an impact of 149, Jordan Hawkins for the Pelicans. Heisman Cootie. Uh, Keontae George Shockwave and a Josh Giddy um, Fractal. And a rookie auto of Maxwell Lewis for the Lakers. Going to Jaime. There's a regular SR Thompson rookie. Groove of Rui Hatchimor. Case of Wallace Vortex. Uh, got a Neutron to 125 John Morant Grizzlies for Inner Stefan. Risky. Uh, Andre Jackson Jr. Rookie, KAT Groove. Brandon Pazimski Vortex, uh, Groove of PG 13. Uh, let's see, Bryce Sensabaugh Rookie, OG Ananobi uh, Groove.
Taylor Hendricks rookie. Uh, got a Sunburst Vortex down to Mitchell number 75. Cavaliers belong to Heisman Cody. Shockwave Jordan, Dan uh, Jordan Hawkins. Uh, Jet Howard Groove rookie. Colby Jones rookie, uh, Tyler Harrell Groove. Marcus Sasser Vortex. Uh, Marcus Smart, Impact of 149 degrees for Andrew Steffen. Ricky Revolution Bilal Kulabali. Uh, got Scoot Henderson, Fractal Liftoff insert for the Blazers. All right, we're through three. Fina Ricky, Kelton Johnson Groove. Jaime Jaquez Jr. Ricky Revolution, Miami Heat. Cam Whitmore, Fractal Shockwave. Uh, Kobe Brown Ricky, uh, Kobe Bufkin for the Hawks, Impact of 149, Hawks, Fool. Shockwave Jarris Parker, uh, Josh Giddy Groove, Casey Wallace Rookie, uh, Julian Strother Groove, uh, Giannis Liftoff, Fractal Giannis, uh, Marcus Sasser Rookie, uh, Zach Levine Groove. Jason Tatum Vortex. Uh, got a cubic here to fit you. The Monta Sabonis for the Kings for Dorian Cummings. Very good. Cubics always look nice. All right, we're through four. Taylor Hendricks rookie. Uh, we got a future fame here to or future frame at the 60 Tyrese Maxey Sixers for EW. Kate Cunningham Shockwave. Uh, groove of uh, Keegan Murray. Colby Jones rookie. Uh, groove of Jalen Green. Cam Whitmore, Ricky Revolution. Fred Van Vliet, Fractal. Kobe Bufkin, Ricky. Uh, Groove, Jay Nivey. Jay Howard, Vortex. Uh, got a uh, Cosmic here to 99. Trace Jackson Davis for the Warriors. The Ryota Fujino. Julian Strother, rookie. Uh, Trace Jackson Davis, fractal, rookie. There's a liftoff of LeBron. Nice. And uh, Maxwell Lewis Groove. And uh, we got a big Benny auto here for the Pacers. This one's on card. Uh, going Doug Brown. 
first veteran, third auto of the break, and again the first one that's on card. Some of the some of the autos are on card, some are on sticker. It just depends on the player, I guess. Uh, five down. Base Wemby. There it goes. Join Strother Groove. Shockwave Jalen Hood Shafino. Uh, fractal Tyrese Maxey. And a uh, Fractal Auto of Bilal Kulabali for the Wizards going to Shlomovich. This will be number 75. Actually, crack, correction, 100. Maybe the vets are the 75, rookies are 100. I'm not sure. I remember pulling one before it was numbered 75. A different player. Either way. Leonard Miller, rookie. Uh, Jalen Green, Groove. Supernova, Scoot Henderson. Uh, Sunburst, 75, Keontae Johnson, Thunder. M. Home, 28. Hugh Henderson, rookie. Anthony Davis, Groove. Uh, rookie Revolution, Amen, Thompson Rockets. Jar Rock. Uh, Fractal Vortex of Asar Thompson for the Pistons. Blake Wendell. All right, got us uh, after Jordan Walsh rookie. Got a cubic here, PG-13 Clippers. Uh, going to Cesar Diaz. Nice. Oh, oh I was grabbing for a top loader on that one. Not yet. I'll let the guys do that one. Uh, Vortex, Brandon Miller, Hornets. J-Tables. Keegan Murray, Groove. Uh, we are through six boxes. So the first inner case, we found our four autos. We found a Galactic. So these next two boxes, I expect by just a couple of numbers, and hopefully some other goodies. Uh, base rookie of a Star Thompson for the Pistons. Uh, future frame of 60, Noah Clowney for the Nets. Uh, Bam VZ 15. John Morant Vortex, Kevin Durant Groove. Uh, Craig Porter Jr. rookie. Uh, Colby Jones, Groove rookie. I uh, got a Supernova LeBron. Uh, Larry Mark Cannon, uh, Fractal Rookie. Jarris Walker Rookie. Uh, Evan Mobley, Groove. Shockwave Nikola Jokic. Uh, Cosmic the 99, Devin Booker Sons for Robert F. Runkle. Julian Phillips rookie. Uh, Asar Thompson Shockwave Cosmic to 99. For Blake Wendell, Pistons. Vortex Chris Murray. Kobe Buffkin Groove.
Uh, Marquise Knoll, uh, rookie. Uh, Nick Smith, Jr., fractal. Rookie Revolution, Amen Thompson, Rockets. <clears throat> Derek Whitehead, uh, Groove. Derek Lively, rookie for the Mavericks. Malcolm Brogdon, Groove. Brandon Miller, Vortex. Uh, Jordan Hawkins, Rookie Revolution, uh, Fractal. Ray and Rupert, Rookie. Sunburst is 75, Nick Smith, Jr. Hornets for J Tables. Jalen Hood, Shafino, Shockwave. Uh, PDs group. Jordan Hawkins rookie. Uh, Brandon Pazimski groove. Supernova Scoot Henderson Blazers. Dorian Cummings and a Big Benny Fractal. Okay, uh, we're halfway home, guys. The first mini or the first uh, inner case has been completed. First inner case had uh, four autos as, as usual. Had our Galactic in the form of uh, the Webby. Um, oh, that's what I wanted. Comes. Uh, once again, guys, we got just six teams left in the Sterling. Uh, we discounted some select teams. The Diamondbacks, Rays, and Red Sox were discounted. Uh, if those three teams were to be bought, we can run a 25 spot filler for the other three teams. Just a heads up. Star Thompson, Ricky Pistons. I uh, got a future frame to 60 Bradley Beal Sons. Or Robert F. Runkle. Amen Thompson, Shockwave Rookie. Uh, Bam Adebayo Groove. Craig Porter Jr. Rookie. Franz Wagner Groove. Uh, Rookie Revolution, Kobe Bufkin. Uh, Evan Mobley, Fractal. Jarris Walker, Rookie. Uh, Shaden Sharp, Groove. Uh, Jordan Hawkins, Vortex. And I got a um, Cosmic to 99, Austin Reeves, Lakers. Lakers for Jaime. And behind that is a rookie auto of Derek Whitehead for the Brooklyn Nets. Going to Bam BC 15. <clears throat> uh, Julian Phillips, rookie. Uh, I got a Cosmic today in case of Wallace Stender for M Home 28. Uh, Supernova Wemby. This regular Supernova Wemby goes nice with this one that we pulled. That's the Galactic that we found. Uh, Jalen Pickett Groove. Okay, that is uh, the end of Box Niner.
Maxwell Lewis rookie. Uh, Julius Randle, Roof. Uh, Shockwave Jet Howard. Uh, Cubic of Alperin Sanguin, Rockets, number to 50. Uh, Rockets for Jaw Rock. Taylor Hendricks, rookie. I uh, got a, a Shockwave uh, Sunburst of 75 John Morant for the Grizz and Inner Stefan. Supernova Jason Tatum and uh, Hunter Tyson Groove. Colby Jones rookie. Uh, Groove of Rudy Gobert. Uh, Sarah Thompson, Vortex. Fractal Supernova, Giannis. And we have a, a Fractal Auto of Alex English for the Nuggets. That one's on card. Uh, nuggets were um, uh, Decian, uh, De uh, Decionea. Apologize if I butchered that. And that one is a 75. Yeah, so I guess the Vet Fractals are 75, the Rookie Fractals are 100. Kobe Bufkin, rookie. That's a Neutron parallel to 125 of Brandon Pazimski for the Warriors, for Ryota. Shockwave, K. Cunningham. Uh, Devin Booker, Groove. Revolution, Grady Dick. Uh, Fractal Vortex, Derek Lively is second. Uh, Tamani Kamara, base. Uh, Groove of Leonard Miller. Uh, Brandon Miller, liftoff. Uh, Fractal Marcus Smart. Uh, Grady Dick rookie. Uh, got a groove here of uh, Draymond Green. Kevin Durant Vortex. Uh, we have a uh, future frame of Joker here for the Nuggets going uh, to Sion. That'll be number to 60. Uh, 56 to 60 on the Joker. G.G. Jackson, the second rookie. Fractal of Sasha Vesnikov. Shockwave, Sarah Thompson. Chris Murray, Groove. Anthony Black, rookie. And a Groove of uh, Miles Turner, Pacers. Okay. Uh, 11 down, 5 to go. Uh, I do have a spot closer on the uh, Prison Premier League breakaway four box break. Uh, team closer on five stars at sixteen now. Okay. okay. All right, box twelve.
Uh, Colby Jones, rookie. Uh, there's a Chet Kubik to 50 for the Thunder going M home 28. Yeah, too bad they're sitting Wemby tonight against him. Everybody wanted to see Spurs v. Thunder with those two guys playing on against each other, but not going to happen. Uh, Kobe Bufkin, rookie. Uh, Olivier Maxon's Prosper Groove. Uh, Supernova, Brandon Miller. Uh, Fractal, Austin Reeves. Rookie Revolution, Casey Wallace. Hunter Tyson Groove. Uh, Shockwave, Grady Dick. Kelton Johnson, uh, Groove for the Spurs. Maxwell Lewis, Rookie. Leonard Miller, uh, Fractal, rather. Taylor Hendricks, rookie. Groove of Evan Mobley. Uh, Keontae George Vortex. And a Amen Thompson Supernova Fractal. Jaw Rock and the Rockets. All right, that's 12. Shockwave, Kobe Bufkin. Fractal, Marcus Smart. Andre Jackson, Jr., rookie. Uh, Groove of OG and Anobi. Uh, rookie Revolution, uh, Taylor Hendricks, Jazz. Uh, got a cubic here, Romari Bailey for the Hornets. For J Tables. Number to 50. Uh, one of 50 on that one. Well, a few more cubics in this case than we saw in the last case. Uh, Cam Whitmore, rookie. Uh, Sar Thompson, fractal. I'm not even sure if they do lavas in this stuff this year. Um, I haven't looked at the wrapper, but I've yet to see a lava. They do do lavas, but number to 10, I haven't seen one yet. You know which version they didn't do this year is an astral. They didn't do Astrals this year. They took that one away. Just thought about that. Damian Lillard Vortex. Uh, let's see. Marquise Noel Groove. We've got a redemption here of. Uh, Kobe Brown. Uh, Fractal Rookie Auto. That would be the uh, Clippers, if I'm not mistaken. Uh, it'll be number to 100. Cesar Diaz has the Clippers. Kobe Bufkin's Hawks. Kobe Brown is Clippers. Trace Jackson Davis, rookie. Uh, De'Aaron Fox, Groove. Supernova, Steph Curry. And a uh, Fractal, Kyrie Irving. Brandon Miller, rookie. Nice. And then behind that is a Sunburst of 75, featuring uh, Fred Van Vliet for the Rockets. For Jaw Rock. Let me confirm the serial number on the uh, redemption. I'm pretty sure it's 100. All right, uh, basketball. Revolution. Rookie autographs. Fractal. Yep, to 100. Uh, box 14.
Ferris Walker, Rookie Revolution, Groove of Cameron Thomas. There's a Scoot Rookie. A Groove of Paps. Supernova Giannis. I uh, got an impact of 149 case of Wallace for the Thunder to M Home 28. Jordan Walsh rookie. Brandon Miller fractal rookie. Nice. Shockwave LeBron James. Uh, Vasilisi Misich for the Thunder. And I uh, got one more auto, guys. Pretty decent one, too, for the Pistons. This is R. Thompson. Going to Blake Wendell. Base rookie auto. Ah, uh, there's another one, B. Ricky. A second one of these. For Calicus 56. Uh, I think that's our fifth Wemby overall. We had two base, two base inserts, and of course the big Galactic we pulled in box two. Jalen Brunson Groove. Uh, Vortex, Scoot Henderson. Uh, lift off Rackle Giannis. Leonard Miller, rookie. Got a sunburst of LeBron James. All right. Number 75. This one I will top load right away. Uh, serial number on that one, 50 is 75. Okay, let's put that one right there. All right. Uh, we've got two to go. Uh, base rookie, Hamish Quez Jr., Miami Heat. Keontae George, uh, Groove. Lift off, Anthony Edwards, and a fractal, Bam Adebayo, Miami Heat. Keontae Johnson, rookie. Uh, groove of D'Angelo Russell, Lakers. Uh, Marcus Sasser Vortex. I uh, got here a Cosmic Dene and a Jordan Pool Wizards to A. Shlomovich. Uh, Bilal Kalabali rookie. Uh, Scoot Henderson Vortex. And we also have a uh, Steph Curry Groove. We've got a pack of six cards in it. So I expect a future pack will have four cards in this box. Uh, Riota's got the Warriors in that Curry. Jairus Walker, Rookie Revolution. I uh, got Giannis Shockwave Fractal. Ramoni Bates, Rookie. Uh, Sunburst, uh, Miles Turner, Pacers for Doug Brown. Shockwave, Brandon Miller. Kerry Irving, Groove. Chris Murray rookie, uh, Jamal Murray Groove, uh, Jairus Walker Vortex, I uh, got a Draymond Green Impact 149 Warriors, Rio de Fugino.
Bryce Sensabaugh rookie. Uh, we got a uh, numbered Wemby here. Uh, rookie Revolution Cosmic to 99. Muy bueno. Calicus 56. One more Wemby. Believe it or not, I think this is the first numbered one that I pulled. Uh, 83 and 99. Jordan Hawkins, Shockwave. And um, Maxwell Lewis, Groove. Uh, Sasha Vesnikov, Ricky. Uh, Shai Jolgis, Alexander, Groove. Uh, Bilal Kulabali, Rookie Revolution. Uh, Fractal Vortex, John Morant. Keontae George, Rookie. Uh, we got a uh, future frame to 60, Buddy Heald for the Pacers. Uh, Pacers for Doug Brown. Brandon Pazinski, Vortex, and a groove of CJ McCollum. All right, guys, that's all 16 boxes. I guess those uh, inserts must be tougher than I thought. The chase inserts like the revolutionaries pulled one of those in three cases. We've seen a galactic in each case. Obviously that's the best galactic we've seen so far by far. By far. Funny, only two uh, neutron parallels, number to 125. Figures have, have a lot more of those. Okay, all right, guys, this is your recap. 23-24 uh, Revolution Basketball, pick your team case break uh, two, 16-box master case. Thank you, everybody, for joining in on this break. 
and thank you guys everybody for helping to fill this out today when we were trying to get uh, getting some action going here. So thank you guys again for that. Here's what we pulled out of here. All right, I uh, got uh, Steph Curry, got a groove here, and we got a Supernova. There'll be a few base cards, but uh, those will be only two inserts and parallels we pulled. Uh, LeBron, we got a handful here, a liftoff, Shockwave, and a Supernova. All right, uh, top rookie, Scoot Henderson. Uh, we found a pair of base rookies, plus a fractal liftoff, and a Supernova, make that two of them, uh, plus a pair of Vortex inserts. Uh, Brandon Miller, uh, one base, and a fractal rookie, and a liftoff, Shockwave, Supernova, Vortex, another Vortex. Uh, Amen Thompson, Rookie Revolution insert, got a couple of those. Uh, Shockwave, Fractal Supernova, Asar Thompson, uh, we had two base rookies, correction, three, plus a Fractal, plus a Groove, and a Shockwave, and a Vortex, another Vortex, and a Vortex Fractal. Uh, Derek Lively is second, we had one base rookie, plus a Fractal Vortex, Jaime Jaquez Jr., one base rookie, a Rookie Revolution, and a Shockwave. All right, moving on to your numbered goodies. Well, most of the numbered goodies in this break. Uh, Impact of 149, Jay Nivey, Marcus Smart, Draymond Green, uh, Jordan Hawkins, uh, Kobe Bufkin, uh, Kaysen Wallace, uh, Neutrons of 125, John Morant, uh, Brandon Pazimski, Cosmic to 99, Devin Booker, Austin Reeves, Jordan Poole, uh, Trace Jackson Davis, uh, Kaysen Wallace, uh, Sarah Thompson. Uh, then we got Sunburst to 75, Fred Van Vliet, Miles Turner, Keontae Johnson, uh, Nick Smith Jr., uh, Scoot Henderson, John Morant, and Donovan Mitchell. Uh, these are Future Frames of 60, Tyrese Maxey, Bradley Beal, Nikola Jokic, uh, Buddy Heald, uh, Noah Clowney, and uh, Cubics to 50, DeMontis Sabonis, Paul George, Alperin Sengwin, uh, Chet Holmgren, and Amari Bailey. Uh, we also found a uh, Sunburst, LeBron James, numbered 50 of 75. That was pretty cool. All right, uh, let's move on to your autograph tits. Uh, eight autographs. Uh, starting with vet autos first. Uh, got a big Benny that was on card. Uh, also an Alex English that was on card. Uh, the uh, that's a fractal parallel. The fractal vet autos are numbered to seventy five. And then we got rookie autos. Base rookie autos. Kobe Bufkin, uh, Maxwell Lewis, Derek Whitehead, uh, Sar Thompson, uh, fractal to one hundred. Bala Kulabali and Kobe Brown for the Clippers also to one hundred. All right. Finally, your Wemby count for Calicus fifty six. We found one base rookie, found another base rookie, found a rookie revolution, found a supernova, found a numbered rookie revolution of Victor Wembyama. That's a cosmic version to 99. And the big hit of the break was that one right there. Galactic Supernova featuring Victor Wembyama. All right. That'll do it for the break. Thank you for joining in, and thank you for your support of Firehand. And congrats to our lucky hitters in the break. Until next one. Hi, Dimitri. Uh, yeah, so we do breaks as they fill up. We don't have a set schedule or set time for any of our given breaks. Very rarely do we. If we do, it's because it's like a really kind of a one-of-a-kind break, like a transcendent-type product or something like that. But uh, generally speaking, we do breaks in the order in which they fill. Thank you, Dimitri. Uh, by the way, Dimitri, if you haven't um, if if you haven't used this code yet, um, even if you bought from us already once, if you haven't used this code yet, you can use that code at checkout. Your next purchase, you can save seven percent. I do have a couple more spots gone on the uh, value mixer. Appreciate you, Dimitri. Thanks, man. Uh, we do have a couple spots gone on the Elite Extra Edition. And a couple spots gone on the Impeccable. All right, I'll give a couple minutes just in case anything else is uh, anything else gets a real move to uh, get filled up and run right away. Otherwise, um, I will call an end to this show. Uh, generally speaking, the minimum they usually go to is about, uh, the very minimum on a Wednesday would be 5.30 Pacific. A lot of times I have ex uh, enough action to keep me going a little bit longer. Today it wasn't quite one of those days. We've had a few weeks where we've had uh, heavy release days uh, leading up to the end of March, which was leading up to the end of the quarter for both Tops and uh, Panini to try to get out some more product and pump those numbers up. Uh, this week is going to be a little bit lighter. We had just one new release today, which was Heritage Baseball. Uh, we did a couple of cases of that. Friday, there's two releases, the Tops uh, UEFA Soccer and uh, uh, Origins Basketball, I believe, releases Friday. So we'll have a couple of new releases come Friday. 
And just to let you guys know with regards to that top soccer, if the checklist comes out for it tomorrow, I'm going to check in the morning if it releases. If it does, I'll try to post some uh, pre-sales from home. Before I go pay my tithes to Mr. Mouse down the road. Oh, boy. Try to get me a good photo of this here. Man, that one's nice. Once again, congrats to our uh, congrats to our regular there, Calicus Fifty Six. He's uh he's taking he's taking gambles with the Spurs uh, in both of our uh, Revolution, I know, and at least one Elite, maybe two. So, shout out to him. Paid off for you this time for sure. Still stuck, huh? Still stuck. I was looking to see if anything else is going to move uh, heavy in the next few minutes. It doesn't look like it's going to happen. All right, guys. Um, I'm going to call an end here. Hopefully, we'll have the uh, that impeccable case for you guys on Friday. Right now, that's the only break in the store qualifies for the Shield Bounty. I got four breaks in the store qualify for that big Super Factor Bounty, including that half case of Bowman Draft Asia, the two box Bowman Draft Jumbo and HTA, that Bowman Draft half case PYT, and the Bowman's Best PYT. And all four of those breaks qualify for that big Super Factor Bounty. Um, we have just a handful of teams left in Sterling. I would venture to guess if the Diamondbacks, Rays, and Red Sox go, Chad will try to put together a filler for you guys, a 25-spot filler for the other three teams, assuming those are the three teams that are still left at that point in time. Um, Elite, hopefully we'll get going for you guys on Friday as well. Again, we'll have two new products in the store on Friday. Uh, like I said, the Top Soccer could go live before then. The Origins can go live before then, too, if Chad has the information to get those um, put together. Um... But um, totally not jealous, right? I think we can all be a, a, just a little, a little, just a tiny bit jealous is a little bit healthy. Beyond that is a little much. <laughs> all right, but that'll be the end for me for now. I will uh, catch you guys a little further down the trail, and uh, I will see you guys uh, Friday. Once again, guys, um, I would uh, venture to look out for Origins in the store tomorrow morning. Chad may elect to try to get that put together. Uh, tomorrow morning, I'm going to look uh, for the uh, see if Checklist releases for Top Soccer. If it does, I will try to put together uh, some Ram Teams breaks for you guys for that. And um, I'll see you guys a little further down the trail. Have a great night.